Yes, you got your bell? I got the bell. All right. That's how it rings. Yes, that is how the bell rings. Every time a bell rings, an angel gets a Jawa its wings. gets a part. I don't no, know. I got who knows? I don't why think is, bells in the, why is in the, the microphone movie. so. Uh, you move it forward and we're messing with the table here. Okay, there you go. You got your yes, right you got away. your no. We got comments. Trent no says this going is on where here. the fun begins. Is Justin's it, here. It's fun already. Tara is here. Hello. Life is fun. Can you read those? Wait, we have to remember. Yeah. yeah. We can't curse. Yeah, we're not allowed. Apparently. I got a message. Last week. Yeah, I got a message. We, uh... Cursing is bad. We did too many curses. <laughs> no, this there's is, no curses. This is like... There can be nothing. There can be none. We have zero. not... We have a zero curse... Zero tolerance to policy. For us doing curses yes, today. Yes, zero. Uh, we, listen, we want to thank... First of all, we want to thank our VIPs for being sure here. Thing. Um, we have, you know, people from our group came over and they hang out here with us. And they're also members of this group, too. But... It seems like a lot of people from this group have actually become VIPs. We got eight, seven. So eight. I want to welcome yes. you new VIPs to uh, our our Patreon group. Uh, thanks for hanging with us. I hope you're enjoying this. It seems like most of you enjoyed our stream. It's, uh, listen, the stuff is fun. There's always stuff. Everybody has stuff. There's like five claim sales a day in this group. Everybody yeah. has stuff. <laughs> what we're trying to bring to it is not just cool, good stuff. Although stuff is good. For trying to bring some more fun <laughs> and, you know, collecting excitement and a little bit of entertainment maybe because we're, we're, we're fun to look at or watch or laugh at or Steve whatever. Steve is here. Steve is another new VIP. Trent is here. He's a new VIP. Dan is here. We had a lot of questions about this stuff. Pal we had some here. claims. James is here. Hi, everyone. Hi. I can't tell how many people are watching, but let's see. I don't know, a lot. A bunch. In the, in Over the 30s, 30, 35. In the 30s, yes. it, it, it ebbs and flows because people yeah. check in. They see how ugly we are. We, well, how ugly I am. They check out. Um, if you were wearing your Slave Leia costume, they'd probably all stick around. Jimmy can't seem to hear you. Jimmy, turn up your computer. Jimmy! We're, we're living in clip right Jimmy. now. Jimmy! We're, we're all the way in the red, actually. As a matter of fact, I Guys, should Guys, are we too down. loud? How are we sounding here? <laughs> we're actually speaking away from our microphone. We are. I feel like I should turn it down, actually. We're living in clip. Alicia is here, another one of our VIPs. She won't be here right. long, though. She has babies to feed. You can hold the babies and still watch us. So there's a beautiful... Is this how she holds the babies one at a time at the, at the same time? There is a beautiful picture of Alicia's kid, the twins, baby girls. For those of you who don't know, Alicia has baby girls. They are watching us doing a live stream on her phone. They are? <laughs> it's pretty good. It's pretty great. Ryan has a son on the way. Congratulations, Congratulations Ryan. Congratulations, Ryan. I love it. This is great. I, I, having uh, Bearing a new Star Wars collector. Eric, another brand new Star Wars VIP in our little group. Awesome. Fantastic. So I'm going to finish setting up. I had a little trouble with my tablet today. Samantha Hamilton said we, we look, look and, and sound, sound perfect. perfect. Thank you, Samantha. Wow. Jeez, I've never got a compliment. Ryan will disappear soon. Ryan, I don't. I love that you're here in this group. All right. Uh, uh, trying to do a live sale while your wife, and presumably your significant other, is having I wanna babies. I want to pull anything that actually got claimed by VIP. All right. Before. I need to do one thing before I do anything else. Okay. I need to set up my tablet. Go ahead. I'm going to speak for a minute. So you set up. your tablet up. So yeah. um. We we posted a picture and you, you know you guys saw it here in a group, but anybody in our our Patreon VIP group on um, here on on Facebook uh, had dibs in this stuff. So some of the stuff uh, people asked us and, and got claimed. So some of these envelopes got claimed, which are pretty cool. Um, I'm not sure. Did Boba Fett get claimed? Boba Fett's off the table. Boba Fett is claimed. Boba Fett's claimed. That All is right. a done so, deal. So some stuff you were here Boba just Fett. for the mail away Boba Fett. I apologize. Boba Fett is going to the Isle of Man to one of our very special people. Oh, man, people, you just... Uh, which I think is absolutely fantastic. Is, I, did I just throw someone under the bus there? You may have, yeah. <laughs> you might, you might be undercover. This is a beautiful, <laughs> very, very nice Hong Kong Boba Fett in his mailer box with his, hey, we're sorry it doesn't fire... Uh, a, a, a spring-loaded rocket paper. Which is kind of hilarious. And it's like, if you want to return it, please do. That's so funny. My keyboard is just dead. I don't know what's going on here. Uh, no baggie, though. I mean, if I had a baggie, it's like it's like almost $2,000. It's like $1,500. My keyboard is just dead. It says it's connected. Still? I'm not getting any typing. Yeah, it's not typing. 
I um, need the keyboard so I can hit sold and hit enter when something sells. Yeah. I don't really need the keyboard, but like the fact that it isn't working is driving me up the wall. It's All connected. Right. It's Bluetooth. It's doing its that thing. That stuff it's has been not... claimed. Anything else? Any of the ships? Or are we just going to know? I mean, you're 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 asking me, but I'm not sure. Ryan um, just wants to quickly <laughs> buy something. Alicia <laughs> lost possible. sound. Okay, well that's no good. Is that on our? That can't be on our end. Uh, no. Samantha was after that box. Sorry, Samantha. We'll find another one for you. We, we come is across them all box. the time. No, just kidding. So you asked me to check the VIP group, and I said I was trying to so, uh, a tablet fix. As far as I know, we've had a lot of offers, but you know we uh, we weren't really trying to haggle with some of the stuff. So uh, the 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 box fighters are still on the table. I think I'm going to jump right into them as soon as we figure out as long as they have. We're them. losing some people because they were waiting for the Boba Fett. That's entirely fine. Oh, that's we're hilarious. still we're Sorry. still losing VIPs. I do need to stress this. Once I start. Yes, Eric, early bird is still available. Eric is a VIP. He's messaging me privately while I'm on the stream. While I'm on the stream, I'm not going to answer your messages. Uh, he did That's also uh, do it here. We are planning on auctioning it, though. Yeah, we're going to start it at a price. and uh, Which is something that we're we're kind of doing. We learned it new. here. We learned it here You last guys week. taught us that. Yes. We have, we have a countdown timer, all kinds of stuff now. I just don't have, I just can't type. I, I, don't, I don't know what's going on. There's no typing happening here. Um, so I guess I'll have to do it on this side. No, I can still do it. It's just that it's, it's very enervating that it is not working for me. What's the word? Enervating. It's an innerving. It's unnerving. It's... Oh, all you right. You heard that term? Is no. that a new word? Did I teach you guys I have word? no idea. You want to jump in with some of the... <laughs> like, let's jump in with the Y-Wing, maybe. Uh, we did have a bunch of people ask if we could do that first, so they could, I guess, presumably get off the let's, stream. Let's all right, the, my keyboard works. Let's knock the Y-Wing and the B-Wing off the of table course. first. All right, let me get my note Because we have a lot of heat on those. A lot messed up over here. Now, we have received two separate offers. We don't normally do that, but we have received yeah. two separate offers. Oh, if they don't sell on the stream, let me know. And I'll Which means I'm not going to come down from the prices. So, and you know what those offers are, so yeah. you know where we would want to be. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, the both of these uh, are unused contents. Mint inserts. Too many things in front of me. I would say mint vehicles that haven't been touched or text tested. Nobody put batteries in these. Unstuck stickers. They're basically the tape popped. They're, That's they're brand new inside. Essentially, everything is still bagged. Uh, the only issue I can see with this is there's a there's is a that, slice on one of these boxes. I don't know what yeah, that is. Let's go to camera two and we'll, we'll look I, at that. I can't reach for things. I'm beyond on camera two at the same time. Camera two. There you go. That's not camera two. That's camera three. I didn't. I thought we weren't doing camera three. Uh, camera three was still set up from Barter Town last week, so oh. I just left it there. Is it this box or is it the B wing? I box? think it's the other box. Oh, okay. All right. The only thing I can show you in this box then is like you know a little bit of shelfware here, as you can see. As I'm destroying absolutely everything on the table behind you. Um. Yeah. It's yeah. This one that has a so the box has a little bit of shelfware, but all the all the tabs are there. There's no ripped off tabs. The um, proofs of purchases are there. Like I said. They're unused contents. You want to pop that bad boy out? Not all the way. I Not just all the way. I've got to be honest. I don't think either of these pieces have ever been fully removed from their boxes. I would hate after we 40 years. We slid it to check. I would hate after 40 years to be the, the guy that opened the box. As you can see, <laughs> bagged contents. They, they cannot see. <laughs> there you go. The contents are bagged inside. The tape has popped on the freaking bag, on this bag yes. at least. That's just kind of par for the course. I think the baggies in the B-Wing have... Um, well, we'll do them one at a time. Them. All right, so anyway. We don't want to get ahead of ourselves. Uh, <laughs> all right, well, what do we have on this bad boy? Oh, oh here's how this works. Oh, yeah, man. Let's, but, boy, we, if you haven't yes. watched one of our claim sales can yet... Can we back this up this train? <laughs> I'm we need go to, to explain how this works we real do. quick. I'm going to go to camera one. Now, um, we've actually changed how we do things a little bit because you guys taught us some awesome stuff last week. While we were doing this for the first time, we have a weekly claim sale we do on our own business page, Firepoint Toys. I don't want to spam the, the group. I don't want to get banned. But we have been doing this professionally for over 12 years as a, as a team, I guess you could say. Um, we've been doing live streams. This is week 123 that we've been doing live streams like this on our own page. This is only the second time we've done one of these streams in a group, and it was the IC. We were here the last Wednesday doing this exact thing. Um, we learned a few tricks from you guys, things that we've never done before. Up until last week, we have never had never done an auction before, but we really liked the way it worked out. Um, so we're going to continue to do that. Basically, what we're going to do here, is this something I need to be worried about? No. Okay. Something Eric El Elrich said that's terrible. 
I bought a mint inbox viewing, and the guy said I just cut the tape to make sure stuff was in there. It was mint and sealed. I've heard of stories like that before, man. It's terrible. <laughs> Cody is excited for his first place at the show up tomorrow. Cody, I, I guess your tracking is telling you tomorrow. Awesome. Fingers crossed that yeah. it shows up on time, and you can eagerly await the ripping open yeah, of the dude, package. Yeah, dude, just say uh, do a uh, do a post in there, and, and you know, do an unboxing. Shoot us a little, uh, a little love, a little love. <laughs> you know. Um. So the way this normally, the way we normally do live sales is we will talk about an item. We'll describe it as we've done, show it off on all of our beautiful cameras. We will then state the price of the item. If you're interested in the item, uh, you would say claim, in this case, it's a Y-Wing, so you'd say claim Y-Wing. After we say the price. Once we state the price and do the description and all that, um, the first person that we see chronologically in the comments on our machine here, which is the, I don't want to call it God, but it's the, it's the chronological, listen, your mileage may vary. You might see yourself first. You probably will. Someone else might see someone else first because of their lag. All I'm worried about personally is my machine right here because this is what's telling me chronologically who got what first. So be the first person to comment claim that I see on our end here. You get the item. Well, you'll hear a bell ring. You will. I don't know where the bell is, so I can't ring it. You'll hear a bell ring. I'm going to go ahead and put yet another thing in front of me so I can worry about it. That's the sound. Ooh, but that was loud. Woo! That. Woke some dogs up. <laughs> That is the sound you're going to hear when an item is claimed. Now, let's say this item, for example, we say the price, no one wants to bite. That's cool. We are going to do an auction. We're going to then state the beginning price. We will state the increments we are interested in receiving bids in. We're going to put a two-minute timer up on the screen. Check this out. Look how fancy I am, guys. Look at that. How fancy am I? Oh, other people have that, right? How fancy am I? Are we I? fancy? We're how fancy, fancy am I? I don't feel like we're um, fancy. We got a two-minute timer on the clock. You have two minutes to bid. Um, we're not doing any lag timing or any of that stuff. That That's too much like work. We're going to give you two minutes. Once that clock hits zero, I am going to comment, you know, time time ended, you know, done. Yeah, yeah. Or if the item has sold, sold, if there's a bid, I'll hit sold. Yeah. And, and nothing after that point will be relevant. Um, yeah, your comment ends it. Yes, that's that's basically All right. So Because that way that it kills the lag. What we're watching our timer right here. We're a little bit ahead of your time, obviously, because it's going out over the interwebs. Um, so that's how it is. Um, I'm going to say a price on this then. A lot of people, Eric is also bringing this up. This is something we don't normally have to do on our own page when we do our stream. A lot of people suggest that they type the price that we have stated in the claim. That way there's definitely no early claims going on. I love we it. talk so much though that by the time we say, like we say the price and then talk for five more minutes. Yeah. So that's not normally a problem, at least not on our well, own that's, page. Well, that's that's a good thing to do for when we're when we're like I'm going to say a specific number on this. Uh, you can claim it for that specific number. Once we do a uh, once if no if that number if, if nobody wants to buy it for that number and we end up reducing a little bit and starting with a um, an auction an auction. Well, then you just type the number you want to bid on. We're going to do five dollar increments, right? It's not always five dollars. Like on a really high ticket item, I'm not going to do five dollars. We'll be here all month. It's yeah. only two minutes anyway. Yeah. Uh, we'll state the increments at the beginning of the, of the auction, right. which is what we did last week. All right. <sighs> All right. So let me just make sure my comments. Unless you're me, my internet is in the future. Yes, Alicia is in the future. Um, let's see. Everybody's good. Matthew, oh. we will get to the baby Ewoks for sure. <laughs> Scott got his snow trooper. Thank you, Scott, for your purchase oh, cool. last week. That was a nice snow trooper. Um, so some of these Ewok babies are from my personal collection because I recently upgraded. Yeah, so they all have tags. They all these all these guys have tags. Paplu does not have a tag. I did not reprice Chewy. I forgot. All right, we'll figure it all out. Right. I know where he was. I'm ready to rock and roll. All right, uh, we're gonna start with the Y wing. I'm gonna tell you the price I would like to get for a unused mint beautiful Y wing. I can't. I've got, I've got never removed from box written on my. It on my is box. never removed yeah. from box. Yeah. Uh, the box has some shelfware. You know, but it is what it is. Camera two. Um, there's no major issues with the box other than some some shelfware, right? We'll show you the back as well. Not missing any tabs, no big rips, nothing like that. Um, like I said, the toy is completely unused inside. Uh, so first person to claim it with the price I say and with the, what it is gets it. Four hundred bucks. And that includes free shipping anywhere in the United yes, States. Yes, that does include free shipping within the United States, not just the continental United States, um, anywhere in the United States. If you are overseas, we are happy to ship to you. We are going to charge, have to charge you cost on that bad boy. Yeah, if you're overseas, we're not going to try and... Um, you got a claim? I do have a claim. I've got uh, Michael P. claiming the Y-Wing. So what's going to happen is I will see it too, but I'm not going to say it because what I see might be different than what she sees. And... Her 
tablet is the this law. Thing, it's like this thing is jacked in. It's like in. Sly Stallone and Judge Dredd. I am the law. Please don't. Please okay. don't. Please I'm sorry. don't. Save I haven't that. cursed yet, have I? No. Oh gosh. Please, right. no cursing. I do not. So I. Uh, I, it was recommended very strongly to us that we not curse on the stream or that bad things will happen. We would get banned. <laughs> I don't want to get out with the band hammers coming. <laughs> I got uh, Trent in here trying to claim the wilding. My man, you're a VIP. You had a chance to get this bad boy. Trent. You rolled um, the dice and you lost, my man. I am so sorry. Trent, uh, <laughs> refresher's feed, you might be a little bit behind because that was like six, 30 seconds ago. What was the name of the person who won it? Michael Payne. I recognized him from All last right. week. Michael, it was nice. You brought the pain. On to Trent, who was trying to get that. Sorry, there's more. <laughs> Don't worry. Um, Mike, um, do us a favor, and if you we didn't buy anything last week, I'm not sure if you did, shoot I us a message. So. Shoot, shoot Farpoint Toys a message on I, Facebook. I would, so for sake of not spamming the group and not getting in trouble, if you would prefer to, to message me, that would be fine, but I have to be honest, I prefer to keep my personal and my business stuff separate, but because I'm me in this group and yeah, not, not the business, Farpoint, right. you can message either one. If you message me privately, I'm just going to try to funnel you to Facebook if I can. I am going to put this up real quick. That is our link. Again, I don't want to spam, but if you could just shoot us a message at that link, that would be fantastic. If you would rather message me privately, as long as you're not a creeper, it's fine. <laughs> Alicia said there's a different breed of people. The thing about the people in here, Alicia, they are specific Star Wars collectors. And unlike when we do our weekly barter town, we're, you know, we get some specific collectors, but these guys aren't, these guys are not afraid to spend money on good stuff. You know, Barter Town is very here. good for deal, like good deals. Oh, listen, our our weekly live stream is absolutely fantastic, and born from that was our VIP. And group. it's always fun, and That's it's always sure. super fun. Yeah, but there's certain listen, certain places you want certain things in certain places. Scott, thank you so much. Uh, because, is this a new rule that we're instituting? Well, I think forward? it's a rule that, that I think it's a rule that that basically everybody it's, in the Imperial Commissary uses. It's a good rule. Now we didn't change the price, so the price was what it was. But say we had changed the price, and Why somebody not? just said claim it. So that way, and that way we know he didn't it, claim ahead of what time. What it really does is it makes it makes it so that everyone knows that person did not claim the advance. So going yeah. forward, we will honor that, Mike. No problem. But going forward, Mike um, did it. Oh, he did do yeah. it. Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Yep. I was wondering why Scott Mike, said that. No, there. Mike is square. Scott is just trying to, you know, make sure that we remember to reiterate that. Eric said they love the live auctions here. It's I fun. It, I can tell the group is like... It's it's nothing we've ever done before. Let's talk about this B-Wing. But it's now a new tool in our toolbox. Yep. Like Same deal with the B-Wing. Unused contents. So the Y-Wing still had one side, I believe. Let me check. Did it? Does it? Uh, I'm not sure. It's got no, those Babyland tape, price tape, tags. Tape, tape poked on both sides. I love the baby um, land price tags. Look at this, man. What a shame. That Star Wars tape. You can go to camera too. Yeah, I'm sure I can if I can That's, remember. <laughs> that, that Star Wars tape. It's just yellow. The cool thing is it didn't pull any of the tab uh, cardboard off. So the tab still looks really nice. It didn't, You know, sometimes the tape pulls the cardboard off. So thank, thankfully it didn't do that. <laughs> Matt is obsessed with baby Ewok plushies. Matt, we will get there. Have no Matt, fear. please. We will get there. Um... <laughs> The only real issue with this box I see is... is it's got a slice right next slice to the right here tags. On this? Dude, that thing was on sale in Toys R Us. Like, what was wow. it on sale for? How much was it on sale for? Uh, is this one the one that was eighteen eighty eight? I can't remember. Oh, my God. i got to be honest. I don't want to move back and forth too much. I'm, I'm feeling a little a little dizzy right now. All right. So, unused <laughs> contents. I yes. know the bags top, are sealed inside top this. one side just so they can see how unused beautiful Unused stickers. Uh, I don't think this has the instructions. I think the instructions fell out somewhere. Is this the one that doesn't have the instructions? Yeah. Is this the B-Wing? B-Wing, unused, no instructions. You've got unused sticker sheets. You've got bags. Where are the bags? Right here. You've got un unopened bags of stuff. I think I have a... I might have a, a blue... I might have a blueprints. Here's one of the wings. They can't see that. <laughs> Here's one of the wings. Look, you the can tape. see... Yeah, the tape just came undone. Matt is on it. He's on it for those... Pl it's nice to see others. Someone else go. who likes Ewoks. The tape is still good on that one. Yeah. You can see. Listen, the tape is what the tape is. And then these the cannons, they, they were just in there. I don't think they were in a baggie. Those are the other yeah, This cannons. one is unused. We're calling... The other one was NRFB. This one is unused contents. Um, no instructions on this one. This is... Oh, yeah. What's our, okay. I see the difference there. Yes. Uh, yeah. I actually... If you give me one second, we have another box to be waiting that's... Not that nice, but it might have. I'm gonna see if it has instructions. I just thought of it. Okay. All right. I, I did not realize. Did. I did not realize. I thought we looked and that we didn't. No, but I'm you're not. now disappearing off camera. I'm running away. I hate it when he does this because then I'm all alone and I feel stupid. Um, 
Matt likes Ewoks. I'm glad that I'm not the only person who likes Ewoks. You know, they are much maligned and they get a lot of of hate. But I'm I'm trying to think of a word that's not a cuss word. <laughs> it's so hard to do. Um, they get a lot of hate. Um, but I was literally the perfect age. I'm the exact age of George Lucas's daughter. So I was the perfect age for Ewoks. And I'm a, I'm a huge Ewok fan. What you got there? Now, is that raising the price or are we leaving it where it was? I'll leave it where it is. All right. Beautiful set of... Look at that. So now this is truly... Murder Bears. Truly, truly. Alicia is in here spamming us on our on our behalf. I believe it even can. has... Thank you, Alicia. <laughs> so along with a beautiful insert, it even has... Um, it has the brochure, like you know, all that stuff. Those brochures do like twenty dollars now. The little like coming yeah. soon or whatever. Well, I know the early ones. Though. I don't know about Jedi. There were a lot more Jedi ones. So I do want to stress, we are adding to our law, our rule of law here, that you do want to post the price that we have stated for the item. So once I say the price, or my wife does, uh, the first person to claim B wing with the price we state gets it. This and has a nine dollar and ninety three cent new Toys R Us price tag. Again, on so the it. box display that is great. That is insane. It has a little bit You're of. You're gonna a, yell at me for not being on camera too. There you a go. A little bit of a tear. I didn't yell at anybody. <laughs> a little bit of a tear down the bottom here, which happens a lot. You can see that it's just separated a little bit. It's nothing bad, but the, dude, know. the front display is absolutely so. Gorgeous. Show them the, the 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 slice just one more time, so they know what they're getting. You got a slice there. Right some, here. Some 16-year-old that was working at Toys R Us in 1980 decided to Probably opening the box. Oh, no. 1982. Um, 83? There were probably three of these 82. for case. 82? 83. 83. 83? I was 83. four. So anyway, the yeah. price on this B-Wing. Yes. $400. Don't, don't forget to say the price when you're yep. doing your claim. 400 bucks on that this is bad boy. free shipping in the United States. Free shipping in the United States. Many we Ewok We insure orders. everything. We, we insure. I do signature confirmation on anything over $200. We pack very well. I don't know if anybody got anything yet that can vouch At least for that. Scott did. At least Scott did. But that was just one single snow trooper. All right. 400 bucks on this bad boy. Anybody yep. into this? All right. Come on. Absolutely. Let's, is this thing on? Are hey. We, all right. Listen. How long do we what give do it? What do I like better? I don't know. Until we feel like going to the next item. Okay. I, I don't mind it sitting. Some people are more behind than others. That's true. Um... Yes? You were about to say something. The kid that's like just getting ready to retire. I'm just reading through those things. <laughs> um, I, uh, oh, I don't know what I like. Michael is in Australia, so we're shipping that Y-Wing all the way to Australia. Lord. Michael, I hope. I <laughs> and look at that. A VIP has claimed the second gift of Christmas. The second gift of Christmas. Trent. Congratulations, knows. Trent. Trent knows not to let something sit, so I'm going to give him a round of applause. Congratulations, Trent. Trent is a VIP. I don't want to keep hitting that home with you guys. I don't want to hit you over the head with that. Let's see. B-Wing unused. That's Mr. Thank Trent. you, Trent, and thank you, Michael. Um, Michael, I hope you're ready to take a mortgage out on your house to get this thing done <laughs> all the way to Australia. <laughs> Oh, it's going all the way around the world. Listen, we do either USPS or we do UPS. I will give you the option. I'm going to show you the prices. I'm going to weigh the box, yep. show you the prices, and you get to pick. You get to pick, and you know, we're only charging the actual shipping. <laughs> there are people that like kind of like, you know, because they don't want to ship overseas. They, Listen, they juice it. I don't whether do I ship it to New York, Pennsylvania, Florida, or Australia, it makes no difference to me. I hate that I have to charge you guys international shipping. But I'm not making a dime on you. I'm going to show you no, the exact shipping. One thing we do do is though. Do do. Yeah, we. Um, uh, can we say do do? We don't fudge <laughs> the. Uh, the. Um, oh. The, we don't fudge the import. The customs. The and customs stuff. numbers because we can insure it for the right amount yeah. if we do that. So it, it behooves us. Sorry for using the big word. Uh, to be correct about that because we want to ensure it. If anything happens to it, we want to be covered. We want you to be covered the whole even, deal. Depending on what country you're in, even if we mark it as a gift, which I do do, do do. Do do. Um, even if it's not a curse word, is it? I, I actually made that same joke five minutes ago. You well, totally missed I'm it. making the same joke as you. Um, <laughs> even if we mark it as a gift, if it's over a certain amount in certain countries, they will still charge you extra customs fees. There's no way for us to get around that and still <laughs> insure the package. Michael said he's been doing this for far too long and he that. totally understands, understands the shipping. Listen, if you live in Australia... I ship it. I will package your product, whether it's going to two cities over or to Australia, exactly the same. So it's no skin off my back yep. where it goes. So I've been um, 
trying to we have a museum we're actually sitting in the yes, museum for those of you of for those of you that are not aware of us we are we are broadcasting to you live from the farpoint museum inside, inside of farpoint toys, Far and toys and collectibles but um <laughs> so i'm trying to complete the diner riders collection and we're we're a okay. few away and it seems like every time i'm in a diner riders group and every time like somebody's making a good sale on diner riders they're from australia and were they I, big diner? I they were they were I think they were bigger in Europe than they were here, um, which is why the, the final wave was like European only the Ice Age stuff. Yeah. But it is the most brittle toy line in the history. Well, of everything toys. is like this big, and it's all made of that plastic. Right. Yeah. So uh, I'm so scared to buy something from Australia and have it shipped here. So I know I always pass. I mean, I, you, you do the best. People do the best. I would hope that everybody who pack, packages things and sends them out does the best they can. I am like yeah, a but nervous listen, wreck. Once, you, once it goes into the hands of, of Johnny Post Office, who... Will dude, run it over. Right. He's out there like, you know, eating a sandwich and driving and things are falling all over the place. So anyway. All right. Um, so congratulations to our two first bidders, our, our two first gifts of Christmas. We got offers for those two items in our VIP group, which we did not take. Which Australia is got all the leftovers, which is probably great. Um, Corey said, nice packing job. Uh, Corey, uh, Corey, you got a box from us, right? Have you gotten that yet? Let us know uh, how we did. Jack, I am an amazing packer. Jack, Jack, v, thank has you. Been, Jack v has been a <laughs> VIP for probably two years now. Yes. He is in California. He is the furthest away from us in the States other than Hawaii oh, or, or, or Australia, yeah. uh, uh, Alaska. <laughs> Corey does not get. eat and drive, but he's a FedEx driver. <laughs> FedEx is a step up from <laughs> USPS, my friend. So, um, so, and I have friends that are... Postal workers, I could say that. Our mailman. Jack has been a VIP yeah, for two years. About Jack. We have shipped to <laughs> California like religiously at least twice or three times a month. We have well, I actually honestly you and let Jack, build up. Jack knows this. I tend to let the the people that usually buy a lot of stuff from us who are VIPs on mul- multiple streams, I will let it accumulate for maybe three weeks, two weeks before I ship. I think Jack had an issue once with a box. Or was that no? That was. Um, it was a guy from Oregon. That was a different, a different California guy. It was an Oregon guy, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah, it literally his box literally got run over by a car. It and was he, the worst yes, thing. Yes, it sucked. So anyway, <laughs> um, yeah, all Jack has to worry about is the freaking wildfires. All right, so we got another thing, sealed oh, box. Right Hold on, go into camera two. I cannot see the screen. We have a giant screen behind our bar here, is which is what I'm referring to when I look up there. Is this a podcast or an auction? A little bit of both. Uh, Mr. Drums, a little bit of both. A little bit of both. You you come for the toys and you stay for the conversation. Or, or you leave because of the conversation. Or, or vice versa. I'm not or, sure which. Or you leave when we say the Boba Fett sold. I'll tell, you, the other. I'll tell you what, there's not going to be <laughs> any cursing. So, uh, this is a sealed Endor Forest Ranger. Tape is good. A um, little bit of a... The, the bats flap actually stays nice and flat, as you can see. But there is a, a slight crease, as you can see it. No getting around that. It always happens. A uh, little bit of box wear. There's a little crunch in the corner there. Uh, but again, it is a sealed Forest Ranger. Um, yep, yeah, totally sealed. What is so it I was just looking at the tape. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you bid on toys. I don't know what to say about this. I, it's sealed. I, I think I'm going to start bidding. It's cool. Uh, do you want to do, do the bidding? Yeah, yeah. I All think right. we. I think this was on the stream last week and we put 250 we on it. We had 250 on it last week. Yep. I mean, we just set a price, so does that mean we just... Well, unless somebody claims it at two fifty, I'm gonna I'm gonna start a bidding yeah, thing. So I'll, I'll give it a few that. seconds at a two fifty sealed Vars Ranger. If not, I'm gonna reduce it and start bidding. It was bidding. Eric Jack. You're 100 percent right. It was Eric P. Who it had was that Eric box P. That's right. right. And then he wasn't. Then he then he bailed because. Uh, it's a long story. It's a long story. We needed him to make certain actions for the insurance Corey, to cover it. And there's a Voltron happen. in the... Come this far point, there's a Voltron in the case. <laughs> we told Corey that we would take a picture of the Voltron case. I actually I'll took it. I'll take a it. picture for you, Corey. I took the picture and I never sent it to you. Is Corey a VIP? No. Oh. Corey's no, not a Corey. VIP. No, I'm just kidding. No. <laughs> uh, we'll take a picture for you. Here's the thing. I can walk around the store and take pictures of everything and we'll sell it all online. And then we have nothing but we like to, to have store. stuff for our store. Yeah. We you are I mean? we are an actual store that is actually open yep. to the public. We work close for 18 months. Um, all right, so I'm going to reduce the price on this Endor Forest Ranger so people can stop listening to the podcast They and start never responded. Stuff. Corey, they is us. And you're still on my list. Don't worry. I got that picture. I will send you a picture. Just because you're so into it, I will absolutely send you a picture. Of what? You got took a picture of the case? I took a picture of the Voltron case. Because there's, there's a Voltron Lion Bot and yeah. a Voltron uh, 1 in there. Corey, a, a you Ruger. can be cool enough to be a VIP. Oh, you're cool enough. You're cool enough. 
Patreon.com slash Farpoint Toys. You can be a VIP. All right. Uh, I want to start the bidding of the Endor Forest hold Ranger. On, hold on, hold on. I got to get the, the thing ready. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, we're going to go up in $5 increments. I want to start the bidding at 200 uh, We got two minutes on the clock. We got two minutes on the clock. I got to get... 200 shipped. I got to get... I got to get my words sold. Am I going to put the word sold here? What if it doesn't sell? If it doesn't sell, then, <laughs> then it doesn't sell. All right. So we're going to start the bidding on this at 200 bucks. Yep. You Displays have beautifully. one minute and 40 seconds little, to, yeah, to Toys R Us sticker. start at 200 bucks. Five dollar increments, you said, right? Yeah. All right. Once this bad boy sells or it doesn't sell. Because we have multiples of these. Um, I don't know what else to say. It's sealed. I mean, it's got, you know, it's it's not like a 9.8 or whatever, however they grade toys. But it's still a, a, a high grade. It's not terrible at all. I've seen these things really torn apart. Right. Who's on the picture? Um, Han. Got one minute and six seconds left on the clock. No bids as of yet. $200 is your opening bid. Han and then some Endor Troopers. Oh, they were really showing the you that you can... They were really showing you that you can <laughs> army build Endor Troopers. <laughs> it's a very cool ship. I like it very much. 50 seconds still it's on not, the clock. The, the thing is, it's not cool. Like, there's no Boba Fett on the Are you running picture. out of things to say about it? No, I can sit here. Like, it's this is... Um, QVC? QVC is all day. Is this a day. podcast or an auction? So it still smells wrong. <laughs> it smells... <laughs> no, you're not. It smells like vintage toys. No, you're not. No, you're uh, not. It's got the aroma of um, no. sad childhoods. No. But you know why it's a sad childhood? It never got opened. 29 seconds on the clock. No bids. Is someone going to snipe it for 200 because I don't, I honestly, that's fine. You still get free shipping in the U.S. Yep. I'm um, just putting Ranger End here, and then I'm going to hit Enter if anyone buys it. What am I going to do if it doesn't sell? It, it just leaves the table. It, it if, just goes away. If it away. doesn't sell, it goes back in the store for two fifty. All right. It just goes away. Because <laughs> we have a store where people buy we things. We got it's eight great. seconds left. Seven, six. Doesn't look like it's going to sell. Uh, it's going to look our first failed claim sale. I mean, it's, it's not failed. Oh, it's zero. Not sold. You can just type not sold. I'm trying to. It just it tried to tag some random person. Who? Nobody. It just. I was trying to say uh, indoor ranger and it just came up as ER. All right, it's over. It didn't sell. That's fine. That's fine. We go on to the next thing. Everybody saw that last week, so they're not into it. Oh, are they into that? We're gonna do a. You um, think they're into this. We're gonna do a claim sale on this. Do we need an easel? Yeah. All right, kids. Here's a big one. Here's a grail of Star Wars collecting. This is the first thing you could ever get. Uh, I believe there are 13 pegs here. There are We're going to do pegs. the early bird stand. There are 12 pegs. 12 pegs. There are 12 pegs. Oh, there are 12 pegs. Oh. So it's not the original baggie. It's just 12 pegs in it's a bag. It's just a baggie. Yep. Yes. Is this thing still on? Are you still on? All right, cool. This is a very nice early bird stand. Um, when I say very nice... Usually they're crazy worn in the center there from folding. As you can see, it gets very it gets frayed in here all the time. That's really nice. There's no really terrible creases or stress marks or tears. The corners are very sharp. Um, it's got a little bit, you know, let's see. Just a little bit of um it may have been like moisture or water damage here. I if you flip you it over, it you can see it a little better. You can see it right there. Yeah. But like I said, it displays well. Both flaps are still here and solid. Um, that one has a little bit of lifting, as you can see on the black. But really, it displays beautifully. Uh, no tears in the, um, what are these, Whatever, wherever these tuck into, like these slits. The slits. So, and then... It has been, you know, the, it has been, uh... Here, stick it. Actually, can you stick it on the thing? No, it's you're fighting me here. It's, there's a horrible glare on the camera. That's the only reason. <laughs> that's really nice. It is really nice. So we were debating. We obviously have one of these in the museum. Um, we were debating which one we wanted to keep. I'm just trying to get rid of that glare. There we go. We were debating on which one we wanted to keep. The unpunched one or this one. The unpunched one has more wear, but it's not been separated. This one is in a little bit better this condition. One's way nicer. Except actually. for the water stain. The the water stain is the um the only real difference. And it's obviously punched, as you can see. Space Club card. It has been signed by 
the owner of all this stuff. Yep, Brit. And uh, for some reason, they cut this part of it off, too. So the, the Space Cup card looks like it's been cut. Well, the card itself doesn't fit in your wallet with that title on top. Ah. So when you unpunch, you had to cut it off. Because he had to put it in his wallet. Yeah, I'm sure had had it in his wallet. All right, so this point. is uh, a complete stand. No bad tears. Displays great. All the pegs. I believe 12 pegs came with it. Um, I think you want to start bidding on this? I think I know what I want to get for it. Yeah. Let's see. Let's. Sorry, I had to check the. I had to check the timer. It was weird. What do you um, have written down here? I'm gonna. I'm gonna say a price, and we'll start bidding at that, and we'll do five dollar increments. How's I have, that? I have nothing written down. Oh, I'm gonna say it then. I'm All just right. gonna, five dollar increments. Five dollar increments. We're gonna. Right. You got your two minute warning ready. Guys, get ready. I you guys. Ready. You guys interested in this or what? Are we still here? Is there anybody in here? I don't know. This is this is a podcast, not a sale. There's fifty something people. So we're in gonna here. talk about this instead of <laughs> selling it. I want three fifty. So start the two minute timer. We're starting at three fifty. We're starting at three fifty. Bids. Yep. All right. Five two minute, minutes. Five dollar increments. You have two minutes to start. We're starting at three fifty, and we're working our way up in five dollar increments. I would have done ten. So the thing about this thing is increments. all over the freaking place. Yeah. Um. But it's nice. That's the thing. It's and, very nice. And it has all the cards. I've seen. Yeah. Uh, without the cards, in not as good shape. Just the stand goes for two fifty, two seventy five. Uh, it's hard to keep track of. on the clock. No bids yet. All right. Listen, if it doesn't sell, it'll go in the store. We can sit and talk about it like it's a podcast. I mean, we have another we one have, minute and 26 seconds to talk about it. We can have a podcast about it. Are we just going to keep saying that? But listen, if it doesn't sell <laughs> like this, maybe I'll reduce it, but also do another... Uh, and auction it again? Auction it again, yeah. All right. Well, we got to make some money. Do we? we got to pay for this stuff. Do we? Or, I guess we We're do. not getting paid to have podcasts. It, not yet. The last time... No. This is it. This is the beginning of... You had to buy this before there were any figures. Yeah, it's, it's true. It's so ridiculous. Yeah, it is really ridiculous. I've seen the uh, the Space Club card goes for 50 bucks by itself. I, I saw that just on eBay. It's cuckoo. Yeah, one... Whoa, you know 50 goes, seconds on the clock? You know what goes for money? Um, the early brochure. To you know, some they, it came with a brochure and it's kind of... I don't know. I don't think it's... Oh, we found one. I don't think it's specific to this. 35 seconds seconds, left. seconds, guys. It might be specific to this. 350. I don't know. Maybe, you know, everybody wants it, you know, maybe it's not a good deal. Yeah, I don't. Maybe listen. we're high. You probably are. Yeah. You don't like sound stuff. I, I like stuff. <laughs> Especially like, you know. We already made 800 bucks. How so many freaking early birds oh, have yeah, we got? We, made, oh, we had, and we had VIP claims too. What's up, George? George, is here. George you have 15 seconds to 15 bid on seconds, this. 15 seconds, 350 on an early we're bird. Starting, That's what's up. We're starting at 350. Uh, we can pay Mr. Drums in Stormtroopers for using his jokes. Okay. Four seconds. You three. could be a writer. We can hire you on as a writer for us. All right, unsold. All right. Wow. All right, I'm going to do a thing here. What are you going to do? I'm going to reduce it and start over. Does that sound good? Are you sure? Yeah. All right, listen, yeah. okay. But this, but that, right. this is going to be as reduced as it gets. Okay. 300. Start so the, now start you want minutes. to start the bidding at three. Yep. All right, it didn't sell at 350. Yep. Let's start the bidding at three. Yep. And see how it goes. That's it. All right. This is your last chance to get this from us. Okay. Trying this again? Starting at 300. Two minutes on the clock. You're at one minute and 52 Mr. seconds. Mr. Drums, you can make jokes while we're hanging here. Maybe we'll read them as long as there's no curses. <laughs> uh, <laughs> early bird? Five dollar increments. Five dollar increments starting at three bills. It's literally gorgeous. Shipped. I mean... To your it's door. It's beautiful. I don't know what else to say. It's all there. It's all there. Free shipping in the United States. It's all there. It's all there. This began Star Wars they collecting. Know. They know. They don't care. They know. They all have them. Yeah. They, everybody has one. Not th So what happened to the guy last week who was upset that we weren't selling this and left the stream? Where is that guy? Get him to come back. Who was that? <laughs> he, he also, he's also upset that it was a podcast too, so he doesn't want to... He probably blocked me. He's double upset. So I did have to. Got a minute left for I did have bucks. to block somebody. Did I What's tell you? What's the price that people want to pay for this? How about seventy-two dollars? No, don't I'm say sure, that. It's They'll a think joke. You're serious. It's a joke. Don't I mean, say I, that. I, you know. They'll think you're serious. <laughs> we almost paid what we're selling it for. With, that's we, true. If you break it down of everything that's we bought. That's very true. Yeah. But we pay good for stuff. Fifty-one seconds. I guess this whole auction thing you wanted to do isn't working. Oh well. <laughs> <laughs> Matthew's here for plushies. We'll make it up in plushies then, Matthew. We you're gonna you're gonna pay so much for these plushies. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> 
It's all good. Thirty five. Listen, seconds? we do have a brick and mortar toy store here in New Jersey, like and we have, have no problem so far. I having an early bird in. set sitting in our case. I in tried the toy so store. hard to adjust the camera. Hal is just here to see how it goes. All right. I mean, fair. Hal's taking notes. <laughs> He's like, twenty all right. seconds. He's like, all right, uh, bids aren't working. I'm surprised that Hal is not posting links to other auctions that you know are what's higher. Funny if I if I. <laughs> If I started this at like a hundred, it would probably go over three. Three hundred dollars. If you started it at ninety nine cents, it would have been a five hundred dollars by now. That's just how it works because people can't like do it. competing. Yeah, I can't do it. I Two, can't. It'll, one, it'll... unsold. That's it. That's, it. All right. That's all good. That's all good. That's now two we duds in mad. a row. Can we do Ewoks now? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's do something's going to sell. I need to feel good about myself again. Let's do some Ewoks. All right. All right. So Ewoks. Oh, someone just bid three hundred dollars at the end. Aaron, you missed it. <laughs> Sorry. You missed it. <laughs> I don't know if he was kidding or not. It would be funny if he was kidding. He came in directly under me after I said end. Yeah. So, Maybe he was trying to snipe. I think he was probably trying to snipe and he failed. Aaron, I'm sorry. If you'd like to buy this early bird, you can now come and visit it at 5113 Harding Highway, Mays Landing, New Jersey. Damn, we're playing some hardball, huh? <laughs> Listen, it was up for it was up for 350 on bids. It was up for 300 on bids, and it, it ended with no it. bids. That's it, right? Let's do some Ewoks. Let's do some Ewoks. You guys want some Ewoks? Plushy heads? I know Matthew does. So, I honestly... Me, oh, look at that Me box. and Matthew are on the same page. Did so you I'm, keep one of these? I did. Yeah. So, we got in almost a complete collection of carded new with tags, Ewok, plush Ewoks. I upgraded my collection. The Paplu here was mine for my collection. I upgraded my collection... Everything else, like mine, are like, I want the first run from my collection. They actually redid the Ewoks a few times. If you notice the tags, like this one is very like. Um, so they changed the font on the tags. They changed the font on tags, and they also changed where the tag is placed on the back of the Ewok. So what's earlier, what's later? The ones I have are earlier. It's more of like a 70s looking Yeah, font, the bubble font. Like a very bubbly font. I know exactly what you mean. And then the tags are over here. Oh. So you and try I to keep all noticed, yours. I actually noticed the coloring is so different. So I bought all those Ewoks for her for like for like our Valentine's days and like right. over the past few years and like you know wedding anniversaries and dating anniversaries. Okay. And now she's just like trading them and upgrading. Listen, you sold a flying V guitar that I bought you. You have upgraded and sold all kinds of GI Joe stuff. I don't want to hear it. All right, we need some. Um, Matthew wants the babies. He has the adults. Well, listen, we're gonna do all the Ewoks together, Matthew. So I'm just, as a lot, not as a lot. We're oh. just we're doing them as we do them. Now you just have set prices on these, right? Yeah. All right. I'm not gonna bother. Listen, if Matthew doesn't jump, all on the all babies these, are new with tag. All the babies are new with tag. How they smell? Smoke free home. Pet. They, they smell like 1983. They actually have their hangers still in their heads. They do. Don't they, they all still have their hangers. I'm gonna go to camera two. Pet and smoke free home. One owner. I'm going to go to Which camera is big. two. Um, I want to lay these out a little nicer. Now, don't put eBay links in here. I don't know if that's allowed. I, it's probably not, Hal, so I wouldn't do that. This is a, and for good reason, because there's a lot of people, this is a rule-heavy group, Hal. With tw over 26,000 people, right. I don't blame them this for This isn't like the Farpoint living. page where we're just like, we're just like... <laughs> fast and loose. Cursing and fast and loose. And we're like PG-13. We're PG-13. Taking, yeah, we're PG-13. We, we drop our one F-bomb here and there. <laughs> Not on this the is stream. a G-rated group. This is a G-rated group. We were not. Being... So we love our little. E yeah. This is a G-rated group. Oh, is this a podcast or a oh, yeah, puppet a show? I don't know. Or an auction? What well, is this? Yes, yes, and yes. <laughs> it's a little bit of everything. All right, we've got three baby Ewoks here. Um, then why did you say anything about finding prices during your auction? How you tend to do that on barter? Yeah, time? we were I just kind of. We were making a comment that you do yeah, that. I was just sort of commenting on that. Um, so we've got Leany the Ewok, we have Wiley the Ewok, and we have my personal favorite, Mookie the Ewok. I thought Nippet was your favorite. Out of these three, my favorite is Mookie. Oh, okay. Just because I like to say the word Mookie over and over again. Um, so oh, these are Mookie. all... These are... It's my Mookie. Please stop. Um, should I, um, should I do this individually? Like, yeah. Or just say, because like... Okay. No, individually. All right. Let's start with Leany. Is that leaning out? We're going to start with Mookie. Here's Mookie's tag. You guys can see. And I'll carefully turn that over. There you go. Beautiful These are beautiful, tag. new with tags. They, still they have don't the hang smell. Tag. They smell like 1983. They're beautiful. We're going to start with Mookie at 50 bucks. Mookie is 50 bucks. What is 1983? And that's shipped. What does 1983 smell like? Smell one Stranger of those. Things. Smell one of those. No, Stranger Things smells like. Stranger Things smells like cotton candy. 
I think. Yeah, it smells like my grandmom's closet in 1983. I have got a claim on Mookie from Cody. Cody, Cody, the man. Cody. Cody was fun last week. Uh, Cory, Cory, and oh, Cody. Corey. Oh, Cody. Oh, I get them mixed up now. They were all I'm fun sorry, last guys. week. You guys were all fun last week. Could you grab Mookie for me, bud? Mookie? Mookie is off the table. Matthew, I'm sorry you were behind on that bad boy. Not... Hopefully, you can get your claims in a little sooner on a Wiley is next. Now, this is, I have to say, I noticed my Wiley is a little bit darker than this Wiley, and his tag is in a totally different different spot on his butt. So I think it's really cool that they changed that up for different, like... They probably just used whatever that. fuzz they had laying around. I'm sure they did. There are definitely variants of these. Oh, absolutely. I, I, I can prove it. I've got at least... We have at least two different I Wileys. think there's a, uh, a gray hair and a white hair variant. There's a teeth variant. No, there's not. No, there's, there's not. There's no teeth on no, those bad boys. They're so cute. Up. Um, Wiley the Ewok again, new with tags. He still has his hanger up on top. Also, fifty bucks if anybody Ooh. wants to claim Wiley. All right. So you guys, sometimes tags. they see me looking up there. It's because we have a monitor where I can see all the comments. We have two. We have actually have three cameras. We're only using two of them today. Yeah. We have a giant monitor behind our bar that shows us the com- shows him the comments. Yes, we have a bar in the store. Yes, we have a bar in the store. It's I a, see my comments it's a here. Bar. It is a coffee bar. So um. So the third, the third, typically her sister's here running the show for us, so we don't have to have this stuff in front of her. And the third camera, if we're not using it, is the dog cam. So I am gonna hit claim the, the claim bell. Yep. For Gary, he said claim Ewok, so All I'm right. guessing that he means Wiley. He didn't state the price. All right. I'm kind of like I I. Well, we're a little loose, but I'm gonna explain it again to Gary. Loose, but it, we did not state it in our yep. school. So, so Gary, so. real quick. Uh, thank you for your claim. I'm going to pull them for you. He's a repeat customer, so yes. I'm certainly going to... Just uh, do us yes. a favor and put the price in when you claim it. Obviously, uh, you weren't jumping the gun because it was well after she said the price. After, we yes. know that. Um, but that's a new thing here. We do my, because, my latency um, is 12 seconds. We do that because the IC people prefer yeah. you to put the price oh, in. So, so we that's know you're not um, jumping the gun on the claim, which makes sense. But that was so that we were sitting here talking for so long. There was there was well well more than yeah. enough lag. So thank you for your claim. All right, and as far as the babies go, last but not least, let me actually write that down. That was oh wild, Jason, right? we see I, I see you tried to claim as well. Thank you. A little late. All right, and last but not least, as far as the babies go, this is little Leany. Isn't she the cutest? So honestly, these are all like brand new. They're new. I, I know they're eighty three, but they're, these are I gorgeous. Would, the I tags would, are in great shape. I would shape. call these new old stock. Honestly, these yep. have never been cuddled. They've which never is kind of sad. They've never hung from a peg. <laughs> That may, may have hung from a peg. I don't know about all that oh, now. You're well, now stop, you're getting a little bleeding out of its head. It, that's mean. No bleeding, you watch. Dude, I can't wait to get to Wicket because this box is beautiful. Um, Leany is also fifty bucks. If you want to claim, please. Please say claim Leany fifty. Claim Leany fifty. Claim Ewok fifty. Well, um, yeah. I mean, they're all Ewoks. Please using the name makes it a little simpler. You can for me. misspell Leany though. We don't mind. You can yeah. spell it L I N E Y. I just want to double check. I'm going to make sure who's first. Yep. I just want to double check here what we got going on. I have got Jason. Nope. That was Wiley. I have got Cody claiming Ewok. All right. So that is two Ewoks going home with Cody. I guess Leany is popular. I guess. Some are rarer than others. I forget which ones because I remember when I was buying them for you. Some were harder to find. I forget who they were though. So I say that she's never been cuddled, but I just cuddle her. So have you I guys guess. ever seen the? Um, <laughs> have you guys ever Put seen the? The, the uh, um, what are you doing? The prototype mom. Oh god, I want it so bad. With the, uh, the sack backpack. for the wa- these are called walklings, walklings by the way. Yes. <laughs> All right, we've got two adults here. Uh, I'm gonna try to go on camera two, but camera two like kind of like chops off their heads. Um, this is Paplu. Paplu is not new with tags. I, my arms are too short. Can you just make sure Paplu's like on camera? But I want the head to be shown. The, the hat's in good shape. No stains, no serious things, nothing really wrong. Um, has been pre-loved, has been cuddled a little bit. Little little bit of dust. Paplu is from my personal collection, honestly. So there's a little bit of dust oh, here. Oh, so this is your dust. It, Her <laughs> headdress is in great shape. No tears, no rips. I think Paplu. Who's we a are a non-smoking boy. home, and um, we I don't think, have pets either. I think Pat Tucker comes boy. here sometimes, but he, Tucker comes here sometimes, but he does not cuddle with anything. Is he a boy? I oh think, yeah, he probably is. I mean, I think most of the... I don't know. I don't want to be sexist, but I think most of the Ewoks were probably boys, except Leany right. and he's got his Princess tag. Nisa. 
Um, when you say he's got his tag, you need to be more specific. He's it's got not, his butt tag. Yes, his, uh, it's the tush tag. Yeah, that. It is not the hang, like the hang tag or There's, the head tag look, or anything like that. Look, his head dress here. <laughs> Can, there's a piece of dust on it. Can you take the dust off? It looks like a stain. There's no stains. It's just... It's just a little bit of dust. Yeah. These were in my personal collection on a shelf off. for the longest time. These... Um, Ewoks listen, like human These flesh. are on a shelf in our bedroom. It's true. They've seen, they've seen some stuff. Don't say that. What? They've seen like this is PG-13. pillow fights. PG. This is G. They've seen pillow fights. Papal is a man, 100%. And, and jumping up and down on beds. Yeah, okay. And all kinds of fun stuff. All like right, that. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave you there. Paplu is fifty bucks. Oh, what do they say? Watini. If you would, that's Jawa. Have you ever seen Star Wars, Justin? <laughs> What's Star Wars? It's this fantastic new. Is it fantasy. as good as Star Trek? Ewoks are like Smurfs. Only is this a podcast? Girl, is this a podcast? Yeah. Or it's just an auction. Um. <laughs> Paplu is one hundred percent a man. Yeah. No, I read that. Not with this hat. <laughs> <laughs> what? Well, maybe eighty seven percent. The hats that's you know, the, the the pink headdress is maybe that's just uh, rude. You know. That's rude. Is it? It's rude. So Papal is fifty bucks. Not, not new today, with, I'm not. not new with tags. I, I understand with all the other excitement and no one's interested in Papalo. Let's move along. Okay. Papalo's sad. Papalo's gonna go jump off a cliff because the Papalo didn't get bought. I'm not going to be able to look at Ewoks like I used to now. Corey, I mean, welcome to my life. All right, so next up on the chopping block, Papu. The oh, e should we auction e Papu? E yes. E e e e Ewoks, they're the spirit of the forest floor. That's how the song goes, is this, like that. Is this a recording studio or an auction? <laughs> yeah, listen, this is how we do things. Our regulars can tell you that. <laughs> Um, a lot of regulars have bounced. They're like, I only, I get this once a week already. I don't need it twice a week. Dude, some of them sign up for it like for extra. Some people pay for the privilege of watching us be stupid. It's yes. fantastic. All right, uh, this um, is what we always do. We're not just doing it because we're here. <laughs> no, this is us. If you're not used to a little bit of personality in these things, I'm sorry. We can just be like, right, let's let's just be Wait, typical. Let let's me, be typical. Let me get my Doritos. Hold on, let's be typical. Uh, we have here's an Ewok. This is uh, this is. Uh, the most famous Ewok. This is um, Wicket W. Warwick from 1983. He's fun. Uh, <laughs> I can't even do it. You said he's fun. So he's, right. is he still strapped in? He is Dude, he's still... around his neck! Yeah, he's choking. He is still... So are we going to auction Papu or no? Yeah, let's auction Papu. All right. Let's go back to camera two. All right. We're going to do an auction on Papu. We are going to auction Papu. Watch a few IC auctions. Lots of personality and craziness. Don't be typical. That is dumb. Thank you, Corey. I love it. All right. So, Paplu, where, so if it was 50 bucks and no one bid for 50, where should I start it? Eric, I know. I, listen, I was only kidding. Uh, I wasn't talking about specifically IC auctions. I was just talking about like the specific claim sale I thing. I put it on camera one. You can stop. Where people are like. Dorito guy. Yes. Yeah. They all look like me. You know, fat, white dude with a beard. It's just the typical thing. Usually there's stuff in their face with Doritos or. Not, you know, why not Funyuns? They're so much better. Uh, well, I don't know. I, I, Funyuns might not be um, I nationwide. I love Funyuns. All right, let's, let's... Funyuns are not nationwide? Do you guys have Funyuns where you are? Tell me in the comments if you have Funyuns. All right, so we are going to auction off Paplu starting where? Uh, well, you got a shipper and stuff, so I mean, I, I, would, just, ship I would just take... I would just take... Yeah, just see how it goes. Yeah. All right, we're going to start the bidding on Paplu at 40 bucks. Put two minutes on the timer. If you want to bid on Paplu, the prices do include free shipping in the United States. She is in gorgeous shape, just so you know. There's no tears, no stains, no stinky. Um, sh he, who, he, he, I'm sorry, I keep misgendering. Do not misgender him. this freaking you are. They, no, this is a non-binary -bi Paplu. Okay, now you're just getting stupid. I'm not. Dan said that Funyuns are awesome. I, I don't eat Funyuns, I don't know. Can I, so I'm obviously not going to cuss. Can I say, f like. No. Like not error on the side of no. I can't say can I say poopy? Sure. Alright. That's not a curse. Like I'm uh -huh. just trying to think of like non dirty like equivalencies. Of what? Of like F words and stuff? No, we don't even need to do that. Alright. Uh, but I do no, I do need to do that. No. <laughs> you just said do do. That's good. Alright. We got a minute left at forty bucks, nobody wants this thing at forty dollars. I can say fudge. It's so gonna it's a fudging beautiful Ewok, I can yeah, say. Yeah, This Ewok is as beautiful as fudge. Yeah. So, One smurfing. Minute. I have four second latency, so this is insane. Like my, my stuff is ready and good. We're all good. Um, we got to ship it. It's going to cost like 10, 15 bucks to ship. 
Listen, I might be high. I Everybody don't know. has it. Everybody who has an early bird has one frack of these. Frack is a good one. Frack. Frack is a very good one. It's like it's frig. Okay. It's get you're getting close, but yeah. All right. All right why do we have to skirt the boundary? Usually, it's me doing that. Because I cannot. Why I you gotta cannot, poke the bear? I can't. Why you gotta poke the? Uh, I can't stop. Moderation bear. I, I can't. The 30 mod seconds, bear. Thirty seconds. Thirty seconds. Nobody wants. Nobody's picking up on our stuff. It's fine. Nobody wants it. They just want to hear us talk. They don't want to buy anything. Nobody wants to hear us talk. <laughs> they all left. There's like three people watching. There now. is. There's times that by 12, 20 and you're close. All right. 12 seconds on Paplu. Matt was hot on Ewoks. And when he was like, oh, I'm not getting them for a steal, I guess I don't want them. All, all right. right. Well, That's listen. Cool. I don't. I can't Four, blame a person. Three. Two. two one. one Ow. Zero. I can't blame a person for, for being after deals. Right, so I that mean, is it. That's Pat about Blue. patience. Pat Blue Listen, goes in the store. Yeah, that's fine. There are oh, deals dude. out there. You got to be patient. I like to And these are, it, to, to me, these are good, screen. they're decent, fair prices. I threw it off the screen and then had nowhere to They're not it. giveaway prices. Um, it's because you said that this, the Seawalk is... We also have a store, and this is what we do for a living. A lot of people who do this thing, it's like their side hustle. Oh, yeah. So they don't mind... Fine. Yeah. Blowing out here, yeah. you know these things pay our electric bills. That's it's true. You know, just it's true. neither of us has a real job. Well, has a we work harder than most people. I no doubt about it. Jobs. But neither of us has like a job <laughs> where we don't work for anything else but Farpoint Toys. All right. A lot of people who do this, it's like the the big fat husband who looks like me does this, and the wife has a decent job as like a receptionist at a dentist place or like a Wawa manager, or like a car mechanic or so a professional wrestler. A, pre- a receptionist, a professional wrestler at a, did you say Wawa? Yeah. That's a convenience chain where we're located. Right. That Those are a lot of very disparaging. I'm um, just disparaging. No, dis, dis, dispar- disparate. They're, yeah. They're separate. Well, I, wanted, very I didn't want to make it sound like women did only one thing. All right. The wives. Uh-huh. Okay. Listen, Wicket is next. Some, some have have OnlyFans. A Whit- Whitman M.A. here, Funyuns Rock. Thank you. I love Funyuns myself. It's nice to be a well-rounded employee. Greg misses Wawa. Listen, it's the one reason people, when they leave the area, they think they come back. Because Wawa rules. Right. This is too... This is too short. I can't... Right, just go to number one, then. Yeah, You're trying okay. to... Sh- look, look how beautiful... All right, listen. I, look, I'll show, show off, off the box. The box. Yeah, show off the, the box. The box is magnificent. It is the box white is really nice. The box and is blue really and crisp nice. and clean. The box is really nice. It's got a crunch. It's got some regular cardboard looking stuff. It's got a little crunch over here. Here's the top. Really I mean, nice. he's still strapped in. That's Wicked choking him. Wicked is still him. strapped in. Um, Wicked no longer has his his hand tag. It's not tucked back in there, right? It's definitely not in there. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Warwick he's Davis. Fine. He's fine. No, it's, there's nothing tucked back there. <laughs> I might All find right. some, some illicit what? materials. Please don't. This is a this is a G-rated stream. All right, I'm going to go to camera one. This wicket is still strapped into his box. He is beautiful. The box is beautiful. The box is really nice. It's got a little the one corner is a little bit, but it's really not that bad at all. He no longer has his hand tag, which is the round tag, the round tag, the round tag with his name on it. Um, Y'all know who he is. Though, I right? have seen so many that don't have that still in the boxes. Thank you for buying me a collection of Star Wars figures, Mr. Mark Hamill. Okay. Yeah. The closest thing to Wawa in California is 7-Eleven. Not even close, Greg. Not even close. That's close. Not even close. I mean, we have 7-Elevens. Um, I want 200 bucks for this. Okay. It you can ask whatever you it, want. Listen, if it had his hang tab, he would probably be like 250 or 275 Okay. He doesn't have his, his hand and tab. And that's 250 shipped. This is a big box. That's $200. 200 bucks 200 shipped. 200 shipped. 200 bucks shipped oh, to you. Geez. I was over. Anywhere in the United States. Listen, I get it if you're not into Ewoks. That's totally fine. Wicket's like... They made the most wickets. Look at the little boy hugging wicket. We sold the... We, listen, that's we had three a, of these. That's called a slippery wicket. We had three of these. I kept one for my collection. We sold one for $250. Yub nub. And this one is 200 bucks. Yub nub, Mr. Mark Hammer. If nobody wants it, are we going to do an auction? My name is... Is... Warwick Davis. I play Wicket W. Warwick. And then I play Willow. I really like... The letter W. Can I sleep while you do the talking? Yeah. Okay. Wake me up. Are we going to auction it? Happens. Yeah, we'll go down and auction it. Wake me up when something happens. Wake me up when September ends. <laughs> All right, are we going to auction this? Does anybody want it? I guess Our not. auctions are not doing well. Maybe we should just skip it. Uh, we'll give it a shot. Tara's Farpoint package was just delivered. It, it That's gives fantastic, people. Tara. It gives people. Is anybody even interested if we auction it? If you're like, no, screw, screw Wicket. We're just here to watch you guys have a podcast. We don't want to buy anything. Let us know that. <laughs> 
I mean, fair. Okay, that's fair. Because we'll that's podcast, fair. too. You can check out our YouTube. We review stuff sometimes. Um, oh, there's all kinds of fun things. Crap. I was gonna, I was gonna record this so I could put it up on YouTube, and I forgot. Oh well, that sucks. Matthew got called into surgery. Matthew, are you having your gallbladder removed? Matthew is a brain surgeon. Maybe you can help me with my ear ringing. No, seriously, Matt. I, if you're a doctor, good luck. Um, if you're a patient, good luck. Wash your hands. Just good luck in general. <laughs> uh, thank you for what you do. Um, Cody is enjoying the podcast. Josh is interested in an auction. All right. Ron is smiling about Funyuns. All right, let's put this bad boy. I'm going to put two minutes on the clock. Where should I start it? All right, that's yeah, that seems about right. Yep. Still with the five dollar increments. Yep. Um, Michael Gibson has a Wawa Royal Farms in Severland within five minutes from my house. So Same, do we. Michael. Yeah. How much was Paplu? Terry Paplu was fifty, and no one, no one was interested. So Terry, if you want to grab Paplu, Paplu is fifty bucks. Fifty bucks. Shipped to your door. In good shape. A couple fuzzies, but nothing I can't just nothing I can't lint brush before I ship it out. Fifty bucks. It's gorgeous. Shipped to you anywhere yeah. in the United States. We do international shipping. Blah blah blah. So let's, Terry, if you wanted to say claim Paplu, um, let's auction Wicket. All right, we're gonna start Wicket at one fifty. Whoa! Free shipping again anywhere in the United States. Five dollar increments. Terry will take it. Terry gets a bell. Terry, I'm gonna take that as a claim. Just because we were, you know, a little bit, a little bit fast and loose there with Paplu. Terry, thank you. T- thank you. First of all, thank you for your claim. Let me get that on here, Terry. Terry, uh, Terry if you've never bought from us before, just uh, you know, since Penelope's doing the stream, shoot Penelope a message. Uh, we got to start the two minutes because we already I said do the have price. To start two minutes. All right, one fifty on Wicket. So we got a one fifty bid on Wicket that's shipped. Um, that is shipped to you. So we're going to have $5 increments. If anybody wants it more than Josh, one fifty five yeah. is the next price. One fifty five. That is a steal. One fifty five. Dude, crazy. the box is beautiful. And the he, box still is his, he still has his... He's still choked to the box. Um, Terry, in future, if you'd like to claim anything, um, you would probably just want to watch the stream. We describe the item. We say the price. You then want to claim name of item, price we named, enter. First person to do that gets it. Um, you're lucky that no one was into Paplu, so he was waiting for you. That is awesome. And it was meant to be. Um, so... Yes. <sighs> Wicket's cute. So why can Wicket speak English? Did he learn English? Where did Wicket learn English? From Sindal. Well, no, 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 no. He was speaking English to Sindal, I think. So did he learn it from her? Did Princess Leia teach him English? Maybe. Like, I have a lot of questions. What was his first word? Candy bar. His first word. He really was, liked Reese's Pieces, right? No, that's ET. Oh. One minute on the clock for Wicket at one hundred fifty dollars. Josh is going to get a heck of a deal, and I mean, good for you, man. We're going to go up. We're going to go up. Somebody said the O face. Somebody's O face and Josh yeah. right there. Someone's O face and Josh. Forty-seven seconds. You got five dollar increments. Yeah, one fifty is I, I, I'm rooting for Josh. I'm, I'm listen. I'm, I'm rooting, rooting for, for Josh with a good deal. Thirty-nine seconds. I'm rooting for. Not that I won't take more yeah. money, but I'm rooting yeah, for Josh. Yeah, listen. I'll root for whoever gives me money. <laughs> Roberto just said no. I don't know what... Roberto, I don't know what you're saying no Wait. to. Yeah, That's Roberto. Roberto just said. Roberto, I love, the, I love your negativity. Keep it going. We, uh, 23 seconds. We appreciate a good negative comment here. I do. There. It's my one of my favorite things. Being negative is a pastime yeah. of mine. 17 seconds on the clock. Josh? I don't think Roberto's going to... Um, Josh is good people. I don't people. think Roberto's going to subscribe to our podcast. 10 seconds. 8. <laughs> Who is going to snipe Josh? This is what I want to know. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh, three, two, one. We got, we got, it's oh, no. zero. Ah, zero. Is, what's going to type in first? You got to type, Penelope. I did type. Oh. I typed. Oh. 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 It's a photo finish. Wow. Good job. That is a photo finish. I thought Josh got hammered. He that is, just made it. That's a photo finish, literally, that I actually have to take a picture of. Just so the world can that. see that. That is beautiful. Wow. Josh, you just made it. Winner, no snipe. Josh, Josh sniped Josh the snipe. Got it. Okay. That was One, tight. See, that was, that tight. was exciting. That was like my heart skipped to be for you, Josh. Because I was like, oh, right at the last second. He, dude, that's a guy who's done this before. <laughs> Winner, no snipe. Josh, congratulations. Congratulations. Um, I mean, great bidding, Oliver. That was fantastic bidding. Um, Josh eats snipers. He did, dude. Um, he was on it. Are they low calorie? Like, how do you? I don't know. Low yeah. carb. They're Atkins. Right. Should we continue with Ewoks or go on to some other stuff? No, let's get these off the table. All right. Oh, just like get Hand them me off her because she sold. Who did with the what? Oh yeah. He. 
He Papu is dude, a Dude, the pink hat. The pink it's hat. It's not pink. It's, it's mauve. Pink. Do you even know what mauve is? Yeah, that. It's close to mauve. I will give you that. I'm just teasing. It is close to mauve. My wife hates me. I don't She thinks hate I'm you. dumb. Um, I don't think you're dumb. Josh, congratulations. Congratulations, Josh. All right, what is next up here on The Price is Right? Certainly. I also eat trolls, but that is another story. Josh, I appreciate a good eater Let's of trolls. Let's keep it G, Josh. We are going to keep it G. All right, what's up with these? What's up with these is that they are Wicked the Ewok. We have got some preschool toys. So just like the other box items that we had, these are absolutely gorgeous from the same collection. Absolutely beautiful. Mint in the box. That's a picture of a blanket. That's. It looks like a problem. It looks like it looks like a puddle on the box. That's it's not. Or it looks like a tear. It's not. It's, it's a not. picture of a blanket. It's a picture of a blanket. Yeah. Does it come with a blanket? It does come with a blanket. And the blanket's all in there. So. Yes. Were these based on the Ewok cartoon? Um, I, don't I think mean, so. they they're using the same Wicked the Ewok like cartoon. Like, you see this on the Lunchbox. Yeah, but these, like... You see it on but, the board game. But in our Kenner collection, I don't have these figures. So they're not... The Ewok cartoon wasn't Wicked the Ewok. It was Ewoks. But there was no Wicked the Ewok cartoon. Exactly. But they did all this Wicked the Ewok preschool branding. Okay. You had magnets, plates, and bowls. That desk. This desk. The that desk. We're going to put back up again. We're going to auction that thing today, I think. All right. Um, it's the Wicked the Ewok branding. Um, both of these items are brand, they're, they're, for, they're beautiful. Unused contents. Unused contents. Gorgeous. I will pop the size. You might want to help me out with that. Um, here, just, I meant the other one, but you can open the same one I'm opening, I guess. Um, just to show you guys. Insert. That is insert. Unused contents. Everything is still in the box. Now, this box is a little rough. The box, the outside of the box is a little rough. I gotta be honest, I think it, it kind of went around the block while it was for sale someplace. It has handwritten on the front there, you can see, next to my husband, it has handwritten clearance, like crossed out a couple times with a wax pencil. Um, the piece itself, your side looks like it has some more interesting stuff. It's got, it does have the brochure. It has the We Care About You paperwork, little brochure there. Um, insert, huh? It's got the insert. I mean, it's. The, the, I was gonna say it's never been removed from the box. But my husband just removed it from the box. Uh, well, <laughs> it, it had to have been because the um, flap was folded up underneath. Okay, of fair the thing. enough. So, right. see yeah, this yeah. flap here? It was folded up. I wanted to make okay. sure the flap was there. All yeah, the yeah. flaps are there. All the flaps are there. The box is a little. Dude, rough. it's totally unused content. It's not terrible. Look at that. It ain't bad. This is very bad. This stuff is usually really beat up because little, little little kids played with them. Yeah. Well, it's preschool stuff. That cardboard is like killing the whole. You can't see anything behind it. It is the wagon that carry human bodies, and absolutely, <laughs> is absolutely that. <laughs> Josh, thanks again, Farpoint Nation. I see off to church. Josh, enjoy. Um, bag. Look, we got bag. Ewok. Oh babies. man, we should have these in our. We have a museum lot of collection. loose ones. Good. So I. I kept these. When we first got these in, I kept them because I love Ewoks. I decided to let them go because we sort of decided that our museum stuff should mostly... Star Wars should be loose. Loose complete. Loose complete is fine. Um, there have been a couple things that have come through that have been boxed that we have let go because we want to keep stuff loose. Uh, why should I keep a box when I could sell it to someone and buy a loose one? That's, what, that's basically what no we sense. do. You know, we still collect ourselves, so even yeah. though we do this for a living. This looks awful. Can we make this look better? Or put it back in the box? I'll put it back in the box. <laughs> Here, you keep talking, I'll put it back in the box. It's you want to say a price? I do. It's unused contents. This is the Woodland Wagon. Is this, um... um yes? What's the donkey's name? Um, Dominic, I think? Yeah, yeah. That is a... That song, uh, as an Italian-American, that song upsets me. $200? $200 on the uh, Woodland Wagon. Uh, I, I did write never removed from box here, but I guess that's not accurate now. Unused. Unused contents. Really nice. Bags still have the tape. Little papers are still in here. I don't know if you guys are into Ewok stuff like I am. 200 bucks if you are. I mean, Star Wars is Star Wars, right? Star Wars is Star Wars. I mean, this is Kenner Preschool, but Star Wars is Star Wars. It has its thing that says Return of the Jedi on it. It does. It has a Return of the Jedi tag with the Ewok. It's really cute. Oh, we have to keep an eye on the time. Let me just pull that again. Okay. Yeah. We have to be done before 8 o'clock. Oh. Because we are, I'm actually going to go to camera one. We are, right after this, we are going to be on our friend Kevin's YouTube channel on a show called Peg Warmers, talking about vintage board games. Speaking of podcasts, we're regulars yeah, on Peg Warmers. Speaking of podcasts, we're regulars on, if you could put this in there, because I put it in and then it fell out when you were pushing. Um, 
check out Pet Warmers um, on YouTube. Uh, at 8, 8 p.m. Uh, Eastern Time. So we are going to do this and then jet over there to watch our stream and live chat with our fans over there. Um, it's going to be a great episode because I actually get to talk. <laughs> it's going to be great. 200 bucks on this. Uh, no one has bid. So maybe we want to... Do you want to do a claim? You want to do an auction or nah? Eh, I don't know. I don't mind having this in the store. Yeah, I don't mind having it in the store either. Someone will come in here and buy it. I don't mind I'm not the, the only person who likes no, the lobster. No, it's great stuff for the store. It's good for the store. So, and, and listen, it's still on the table for 200 bucks. I don't want to go any lower than that because it's bagged. I'll put it in the store for 200 So, if anybody wants it, it's still here for 200 If not, it'll go in the store. You walk, you walk fire cart, same exact is this, stitch. Is this where they set fires? Now, this box is nicer, though. It's this crisper. This box is nicer. Oh, what do you got? I got a claim on the oh, Woodland Wagon. It. Look at that. From Cody. Woodland Wagon. Cody was like, oh, they're not going to auction it? I better go. I better get it. <laughs> <laughs> now, Cody isn't Corey. Cody and Corey are two totally separate people with two totally separate... Um, names. They have different names. All right. They are from different places. All right. They have different um, images as their profile picture. They have different hopes and dreams. I like that Josh said Farpoint Nation. Yeah, I like that. The Farpoint Nation. That's All right, cool. so this is like uh, same thing. Insert. This is same condition as the last piece. We've got... This side is... Is that one still taped? No, the tape is uh, dried off. It happens. I mean, again, it didn't pull any of the... No, so we've got bag the bag stuff. This Kenner tape is terrible. The Kenner tape is awful. You know, if Kenner really did care, they'd use better tape. <laughs> the only thing more awful than the Kenner box tape is the Kenner bag tape, which is just like... It's like we really do tape. care. We really do care. They really go off on that whole really it's do care. It's care. Thing. It's fun. So this is a fire cart. This is so they brought um, Vader's body out onto the pyre on this cart. You don't see it on on the movie. It's after. Oh, like, it's so this is like. Um, so yeah, this is what expanded they, universe. Yeah, so they so, they bring Anakin's body out on this cart. <laughs> was um hold on a second. I want to talk about this guy right here. Who. I don't know. The really happy kid? Who are this we talking guy. about? He's the one that set oh, yeah. the, he's the one that doused Anakin in, in, in kerosene. Yeah, to make, this to make it all happen. Gleamy. They're like, no, he has a name. Don't don't unname him. Glo it's Wicket. Oh no, it's Nisa. Who is this? Oh. This one is Nisa. The fireman one is Wicket in the little fire hat. That's Wicket in Fire Hat. So Wicket is out there with Anakin's torso, just throwing gasoline over him. <laughs> um And then I guess they ate him afterwards, right? Yeah, nub. Did they eat him afterwards? Yeah, nub. And just like, no. They did not eat Anakin. He was already well done. They didn't want him. Um, here, let's spin it back around. The box on this He was probably right delicious. Place. He was kind of fat. Listen, I, this is going. This conversation is going to a place I don't... Fireman know. Ewoks. We really do care. Is there another paper They're, over there? They, listen, they really hammer home the we really, really do care stuff. Um, this insert is very ugly. I mean, I would say they're sealed baggies. The tape is just, the tape, you know, The it tape is, what is, it is the tape, man. Yeah, it's cute little... Let's start some fires. Yeah, care. They're like the Fahrenheit 451 okay. firemen. Are they burning books? They start the fires. They don't put them out. <laughs> Doused Anakin and kerosene. Hey, we're getting some laugh out louds. Traveling barbecue grill. Um, <laughs> I can't even figure out how this opens. Just leave it. This base. has probably never been open. Like, yeah. There you go. There's your Ewok fire card. Inserts the whole deal. Um, what do you got on this? Two hundred bucks on this. Two. All right, it, same deal. It's the same price as the other one. It's a little. The, the box is nicer on this one than the other one. But the other one's a little bit So this better. works great if the preschooler has a easy bake oven as well. They can combine the two things and set fire to their room. <laughs> I thought this was G rated. It is G rated. We're talking about uh, fire is bad. Stop fires. drop and roll, children. Yes, Eric is totally right. Preschoolers need to play with fire. That's See? what I'm that's what I'm getting from this. Stop he's he's asking a question. To kill a mockingbird, isn't that one of the books from Fahrenheit four fifty one? I don't know if they talk about that book I in there. Know. I got nothing. I am so dizzy right now. That I might actually have to stop the stream. Oh. Like this is bad. This is getting getting bad. I have to I'll stop moving away. my hands and arms. Here, I'll do more. It's of that. bad. I'm sorry. I'm making you do everything. This is why we can't have nice things. George, you hit the nail on the head. Um, Two hundred dollars on that. The box is nice. If nobody wants it, I'm gonna put it in the store. I have no problem. Box putting... flaps are nice. The whole it's, deal. It's really nice. I if I collected box, I would be keeping both of these. I have both of these items loose, incomplete. I'll complete them when I complete them. It's no big deal. Two. I will. There you go. That the haircut on that kid. Let's, let's do fire. <laughs> let's play fire. 
This is why we can't have nice things. George is 100% correct. So listen, no one wants it. That's cool. I sold I sold the other wagon. I feel okay with that. The fire cart is it's it's just so cute. Like Wicked's got a little fire outfit on. It's even the Fire Nation. And everything changed when the Fire Nation attacked. See? Yes. All right. What's next up on our list of ro rotating wheel of fun? Um, 12 inches of Mark Hamill. I thought this was a G-rated podcast. It is. It's 12-inch <laughs> Luke. I thought we were G-rated. Uh, okay. Very nice box. Uncut. Nice window. Firmly attached almost all the way around. There's a couple little spots where it's not, but it's basically firmly attached. Uh, I No insert. There was an insert that he was strapped to. There's no insert inside the box. He is complete. Lightsaber, um, uh, hook, <laughs> the whole dealio. Uh, like I said, box is beautiful. The bottom is still sealed. The comments are fantastic. Hal is uh, the Imperial Legion. It should be glad that Ewoks did not bring napalm. Um, Let's see what's going on I here. love the smell of napalm in the morning. Nub, nub. Uh, it's got the We Really oh, Do Care. This is my favorite thing. Check this out. Just I, in I'm, case you guys didn't I'm know. I'm actually going to get up, even though I might pass out. Kenner really does care. Important. To remove and replace Luke's action boots, simply sprinkle a little talcum powder into the back of the boots. So Luke is beautiful other than it looks like the um, lightsaber got a little bit of black on his little handy there. Uh, but his, he's just, look at his belt. There's the uh, hook. So he's got a little bit, is that gunk, like, would it come off of his hand? Or is it know. stained from the lightsaber? I'll let you look at it. Okay. I think it's stained from the lightsaber. While I'm looking at his hand, um, we could address a question from John. Hey, all, is this an auction? Um, well, I'm going to ask a specific price for this. Are you? I if thought you were going to start on the birds. All right, I'm going to start with, yes, this is an auction. <laughs> this but specific item it, is an auction. I'm going to start it at a specific price. I think... You ready for the two-minute morning? Um, this is coming off. Oh, good. Let her clean that. It'll be even It'll be even better. It'll be even more tempting to bid on. Lightsaber's in great shape. Uh, like I said, the box is really nice. Displays really well. I know high-grade versions of these do a lot of money. Um, yeah, it's kind of... It, it's mostly coming off. I don't want to scrub him too hard. It's definitely from the handle of a lightsaber, though. All right, so... Let's start the bidding. Five dollar increments. Oh, wait, I gotta get my. Should I go to camera one or camera two? Uh, right there is fine. Right here. Yeah. All right. It's gonna cover his face as soon as I put it up. Are you guys ready? We're for the two minute warning. Two We're gonna minute, start it. Two minute timer. At two fifty. Two fifty. Two hundred fifty bucks. Move him oh, just a little bit closer. Free to shipping, you. right? Free shipping in the United States. To be clear, uh, no insert, but the box is complete. There's no, there's no, uh, the window's still 90% firmly attached. The uh, tabs are all there. He is complete, as far as I can tell. All right, we have a bid from Jimmy for two fifty. dollars um, It's got the We Really Care, because they really care. One thirty six. This talks about I the, love that. the talcum powder. That's so cool. Uh, it doesn't come with thing. talcum powder. I mean, if this goes over 300 maybe I'll include some. <laughs> Uh, the, like I said, the, the proof of purchase is there. The box is nice and crisp and straight. Um, I don't know what else to say about it, man. He's really nice. I don't do box 12-inch. I would love to keep the Luke because the Luke himself, is his head is great. Call free shipping. We're not doing free shipping internationally. Free shipping is only within the United States. Yeah. We will charge you exact cost to ship out of the United States. We will ship anywhere you are. 58 seconds on the clock. No repro. You got less than a minute. And what's it at right now? It is still at 250. 250. It's still at 250. That's a, that's a hell of a deal. Yeah. Um, uh, the, so, I've seen the box and insert do more than 250. Yes. Listen. We don't. Him, we there is no size. insert. He's he's covered by the thing. Just so you know, there's no seconds, insert. No but insert. The box is box very is nice. nice. Luke himself is nice. It's got a little. Um, Look at that picture of Mark Hamill. Black plastic. What a hands. what a pretty boy he was. Jimmy is saying, snipers, where are you? <laughs> he's, 25 he's ready. Jimmy, seconds. Jimmy, you better be ready. Somebody's probably waiting in the wings because it's only a $5 <laughs> increment. They can yes. be here for 5 bucks. you got less than 20 seconds to, to get on this 16, thing. 16, 15 seconds. Jimmy is going to get a deal. The, listen, even the flap doesn't have a crease. The flap Seven, is even bent over. 6, six 5, five <laughs> 4, 3, 
Where are you guys at? Let's see. I'm just going to give it a second to settle in, make sure we're all good here. Let's see what the... Because oh, you, you type in right there, I right? did. We're I, waiting I for typed. that to come up. I typed. Nope. George tried. George, you were close, but no cigar. No cigar. Jimmy got it. Yeah. Jim, George, man, tried to get in there sniping. Very Jimmy, close. congratulations. Jimmy, congrats on that That might have been boy. the deal of the day. Yeah, I think that was the deal of the day. That's a great... Wow. That's... I, I'm... That, that, Fantastic, fantastic. We great, need a complete job. Luke for the museum. Jimmy Barilla. And of but course, I couldn't, couldn't, I couldn't take yeah. it out of this box and Where keep it. Where is Luke? 250. You, you were going to start that at three. I was. You were. Congratulations, Jimmy. You get the bell. Jimmy, if you haven't yet, do me a favor and either shoot a message to our Farpoint page. Again, I don't want to spam too much, but it is the best way to contact us. Again, this is all one owner stuff. There That's are no Facebook repro page. here. You can message me directly, but I kind of hate it. Um, <laughs> you can message the page either. It just gets else. overwhelming on your personal page. It does because it's it just it does. Business is better, but I'll take whatever I can get. Thank you, Jimmy. Congratulations on that great. Yeah, Jimmy, piece. that was very good. Why not? Yeah. All right. What do we? What else is here? Oh, I got. You these, got puzzles. Got these two cute little weird things. I got these two puzzles. Got cool. some mail wig figures. We could do them. Anybody interested in empty boxes with with um with yeah? I'm sure people are interested. Listen, maybe that some of the Ewok people are here and they still want to spend money. I'm going to put Chewbacca back up. What a whoop. <coughs> he's not an Ewok. He's not, but he's plush. He's a pork eater. Stop. Um, where's that easel? See if we can jam it behind his butt to make him work better. Mm. <laughs> Please. Cody wants empty boxes. George said shippers. No, they're they're just we've got a droid factory empty box, a hammered X Wing box. Yeah, we got a couple shippers. We and have a, um Oh do we? We have a oh, the mailers, Emperor sorry. and his shipper and uh Let's do those first. I'm gonna go around And nine two. numb. Alright. This this is very common. We have uh it's a a blank box. I don't know if it if this one was supposed to have addresses on it, but it's blank. It's a mailway emperor complete. The baggie has been opened. So it's just a mint. Scott, nice you did not miss the droid. Well, you kind of missed the droid factory. That's an empty box. Yep. <laughs> we didn't sell it yet, though. We didn't sell it yet, but it is just an empty box. But it is just an empty box. Yeah. Uh, and it has the brochure. So the emperor with the brochure in a Kenner baggie, but opened, complete. Uh, what do we got on it? Um, show the folks at home him a little better. He's not coming up really well. Um, well, I had a VIP price. Is that the, the price? Is that this price? No, the VIP price was like five hours less. Yeah, so forty bucks on the Emperor. Forty shipped. I know he's very common. Yeah, it's all good. Uh, we'll take on the Emperor. That's with the box, with the baggie, with the complete Emperor and the brochure. Yeah. That's shipped to your door. Yep. And then there's also a nine num, uh, with the mailer box. With the address. Has the address on it. That's cool. Him. He's Him. gone. He's complete. No baggie. Him. Uh, and the paper. It's not the revenge paper. Did he have a revenge paper? Or Akbar had a revenge Akbar paper. Akbar had a revenge paper. Yeah. But he has I his paper. I was just shocked to see. People are asking 50 bucks just for that piece of paper and getting it. And people are selling them. It's got a little bit of yellowing on it, you could see. Yeah. But it displays it's a piece well. Of paper. Yeah. We have got. We have got 80 bucks on that. 80 on that shipped? 80 bucks. Is that a good price? Uh, it's the price that we made up for it. All right, I gotta put my phone on. Uh, do not disturb. You probably should do that. That would be awesome. We have eighty bucks on that. And spinning right around. I'll tell you what. If you want both, I'll do a hundred both. Whoa. So if you want the Emperor wow. and Nine All Numb, a right. hundred both ship to you. If you want to claim both, please say claim both. Yeah, let us know. There's no listen. There's no. There's no lag. People sniping or anything. It's been. I have so such low latency that Man, no one has said anything. My phone is about to die. Um. Here. If yeah. my yeah, if, if my if that if this thing starts to die, then we got it. You can do a hundred bucks bucks for both. You can do eighty for one and forty for the other. You can mix and match. I'm gonna spin around two. They're very common. Some puzzles. You know you need a brand new unopened unused puzzle. That's in life. the thing about them though. They're yeah. early. And Kevin, we haven't gotten to Chewy yet. Kevin, uh, Kevin Chewy will be We're almost to Chewy. These are sealed puzzles. I've got two of the same X-Wing puzzle going on there. Those are 60 bucks a piece. Uh, seriously, just because of the condition, 
Look at these boxes. Completely sealed. They're really nice. Uh, you usually see these are usually missing a piece. The boxes usually have splits and all that stuff. We have stuff. literally like seven these of them. These are sealed missing. and beautiful. Yeah, they're really nice. Uh, I gotta be honest, a fifty a piece on those would be nice. Okay. I, it, it is what it is. I mean, go find one. So fifty a piece on these sealed vintage puzzles. Go find one. And make right. a great gift for your mom, who will sit and put it on her 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 uh, coffee table, and you know, do a little bit of puzzling. Uh, what are they called? Is someone gonna open this? And no, you're not gonna open this. Oh, you're not gonna. No. You're, you're not buy this to open. If you buy it, you're allowed to open it. That listen, yes. if that's between you and God. I don't want anything to do with you it. You can open it all you want. Um, chewy, plush chewy. So plush chewy was on the chopping block last week, and he didn't sell. I know. So we drop him from last week. Uh, yeah, a little bit. Plush chewy has his. Look at this card. I'm going to camera too. Don't worry. The card is really nice. He comes with it. The card what is was beautiful. the second puzzle? Jimmy, it's two of the same. Two of the same. We just have two of the same yeah, one. Yeah, two of the same. Uh, Chewy's Bandolier is good. It's got old tape on it, which I guess it came with. It came, so the the the, the ammo was taped to the yep. to the belt itself. Uh, his belt is in great shape. It's just a piece of vinyl. Uh, his tag on the back of his head is great. This is 77 or 78, right? He's early. Uh, you have a tag in your hand. Take a look. I couldn't read that if you paid me. <laughs> so last week we had 140 on him. What should we do this week? I want to start bidding on him. What are you showing me? His tag. I couldn't read the year. He's early. Uh, 77. So get the um, get the timer ready and we'll start bidding on him. Okay. At what? what at where? At $100. All right. We're starting Chewy at 100 bucks. He is new with his tag, but it's not. The tag is no longer attached to him. He needs to be to a him. little bit combed. <laughs> it, you might want to comb him. I'm going to put two minutes on the clock. If anybody wants to bid on Chewy, we are starting at 100 bucks. Dude, the tag isn't even Baca. ripped. The hole is Hello, still there Chew where Baca? the string what, came through. Yeah, it's just... Listen, it probably... I mean, this happens a lot. It probably just fell out. Like... Yep. Got pushed and went out. He is unused. He's in gorgeous shape. Yeah, he's cute. I mean, he could use a brush. He's, like a, Honestly, he's a walking carpet. I don't know if I would brush him. You might mess him up. Blow dry? Like, and give him metal, finally? He does deserve a metal. He does deserve a metal. That's for sure. I don't think it would have fit over his head. A minute 23. I wonder if anybody wants Chewy. I Kevin, don't think so. now's your chance. How much was Chewy? He's starting at 100. Bucks. You could probably get him for 100 bucks. Shipped for free as long as you live in the U.S. And that is including free shipping within the United States. But if you States. live in Australia, it's not happening. If you live overseas, we're happy to ship to you, but we are going to charge you exact costs. You have one minute and five seconds to bid on this bad boy. It, we do a good job of not getting boring while the minute timers are going You think down. so. Well, I mean, we just never shut up. That's true. But at least we're not like... There are streams where people never shut up, but it's like... It's bad. Please shut up. Um, I think we might be that. Well, at least we have each other to talk to. Sure. Yeah. What do you want to talk about? Um, Peg warmers? Yes. We have to, We have 20... We have 30 minutes exactly to finish up the stream and go over to the Peg warmers YouTube. We are having a pledge drive. Um, no, we're not. And we're <laughs> looking for th five callers in the next 34 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I hate when I'm listening to NPR and they do that. Yeah. And you're just like, please, Patrick Stoner. Yes, please. Just get back to Fresh Air with Terry Gross. Fresh Air. I'm really enjoying this interview with Elvis Costello. No, 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 20 no, 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 seconds no. on the clock. 100 bucks. Kevin, come on, man. It's like it's brand new from 77. He even smells good. That's all right. Okay, yeah. maybe he doesn't smell good. We have good. two of them in the case. 10 seconds. He's not popular. What if this was like a, a stuffed Han Solo? Um, Like stuffed like... Like... And it's over. Yeah. No Chewy. No one wanted Chewy. It's no, fine. Chewy. He'll go in the case long. Do we really have two in there? No, we have one. So one, him plus him makes two. Oh, yeah. We can say one is lumpy. Him plus him equals two. Wait a second. What do you see in there? I see a claim before yours. All right. In that case. You see it, right? I do see it. Michael Payne. It's absolutely there. Thank you, Michael Payne. Michael. You, you just beat it, too. You just, you just. I think we'd let him have it, though. I'm absolutely going to let him have it. He, he sniped no one. I love that. He Mike, you were himself. very close. He was just practicing. 100. Good job at coming in the last second. Lumpy is the best. Cody, I'm, I'm questioning your commitment to sparkle motion with that. Cody knows what's good. Michael Payne. Bring in the pain, Michael Payne. Congratulations. That was a fantastic deal. He's really cute. It's really good. Aussie lag. You're good. You you made it before I said Chewy end, so you're all set. All right. 
What we got here? This is a Droid Factory box. Um, do you care about auctioning puzzles or just put them up like on the online just store? Just put them on the online store. Right. We do have our own online store, farpointtoys.com. Yeah, I don't want to spam too much, but we're uh, all over the internet. All right, one side of this <laughs> is still sealed tape. Let me go to Ken too. Uh, the proof of purchase has been carefully removed. Carefully removed. The box displays fantastically. That's, a, that's a really pretty. Yeah, that's really nice. Uh, no issues with the, uh, you know, all the, what's it called? What are these called? Flaps. Flaps are there. They're called flaps. I can't tell you if the flaps are on this one. I, I, I assume they are because it's still sealed on that side. So you this thing is look in. beautiful. <laughs> also has the famous. It has the instructions. Now, we this really is just, do care. This is just This is a parts box. list. Right? Oh, cool. And okay. also, the blueprint instructions. Complete booklet. Uh, no droid factory, no parts, just this and this. Empty box. Empty box with them. Paperwork, instructions. Did I give you a price on this? Um, No. No, you did not. Ship to your door. I, is 80 bucks too much to ask? I mean, Well, maybe. no, in a second. Yeah, maybe. I don't think so. I, I, I gotta be honest with you, I think this is probably 40, 30, I don't know, this is 50, you know. I hate separating things. No, these go, oh, like, the, the, the droid factory, yeah. This, this survived this long, with the instructions and the paperwork still in it. I'm not gonna be the guy who takes the paperwork out of the box and sells it. Did you make I a Donnie Darko reference? I did. I questioned... Oh, Sparkle Motion. I questioned Cody's commitment to Sparkle Motion That's by right. saying he likes Lumpy. Yeah, I was just making sure you weren't talking about the dinner party, because we would get banned from... The, the dinner party. When they're at dinner together? Do you mean Breakfast? Is it breakfast? How exactly? Yes. Yeah. No, it's breakfast. Yeah. Justin, it's breakfast. Okay. It's not a dinner party. I just didn't want you quoting that scene. Why not? Because I think we'd get the band hammer would come down. When you an animated hammer, like no, don't. The band hammer. I guess eighty dollars is too much. I guess so. All right. Well, whatever. <laughs> Someone's tagging someone. Maybe Kirk really needs an empty box for his droid factory. Maybe. What else we got here? That thing looks this like... This is a destroyed box. I don't know. This, I mean... It's it's hammered. Speaking of hammered... Do you want to just throw it in with something that somebody bought this week? Yeah. Like, as a raffle thing? Yeah, it's, it's missing the entire side. I mean, if you're into, like, beat-up boxes. If you're into beat-up boxes and Star Wars Listen, and Listen, some people like affordable stuff. I mean, it does display okay. I mean, do you want to sell it or not? Well, maybe. <laughs> is this an auction or a podcast? A little bit of both. Right, yeah. Column A, little column B. <laughs> Mostly column B. All right, what is this nice looking thing? This is the Land of the Jawas box. Is it Land of the Lost? No, same deal. Dean fell asleep. Sorry, missed the lot. Dean, you are still here. I have not missed anything. We are still going strong and having a fantastic time. Georgia spies a Land of the Jawas. Georgia, it's just a box. Just, just another box. It's just a box. With instructions, though, beautiful instruction booklet. No creases, no discoloration. That is really nice. Look at this booklet. That's really nice. Trifold booklet. Boy. Yeah. In great shape. All right. So you got that. Scott, it's an empty box. You the got Joy a Factory, beautiful. The Joy Factory box is empty. It's 80 bucks. Shipped. It shipped to you. It does have the instructions and the We Care paperwork. All right. right? So same deal. Complete box. No insert. Uh, the the POP has been the POP cut. has been carefully cut out, just like the last one. But the box is just so square. It's so nice I'm and displays so well. Um, it's really nice. Square, nice. It's really nice. It's really nice. It's really nice. How much you want for it? Eighty-five bucks. Is that too? I don't know. Is that too much? I didn't really look up boxes. It's, so you're it's just tough. making up numbers. I'm just making up numbers. Right, and I know see. if it sells really fast, it's a really good price. <laughs> and if it doesn't sell, it must be high. Yeah. Or some or nobody needs it. I love that for this week's stream I made a little image of like Sindel and the, the kid Some people love that. True Struzan. Walk. It's really nice. I, I thought that was clever. Sindel. Eighty five bucks. Yeah. Oh. Anthony has claimed the land of Java's box. Thank you, Anthony. Anthony D'Onofrio. Anthony, if you have not done so yet, do me a favor. Um, you can either message me directly. I prefer, if you don't mind, if you message this link. It's our Facebook page. Um, we do have a business. 
So if you wouldn't mind hitting the business page up so I can send you a checkout this link at the end of the stream. Box. That's cool. If you'd rather message me directly, as long as you're not a creeper, that's okay too. But the business is a better way to contact us. Um, it's a really nice box. It is. Good, a good pull on that one. So that's awesome. With really nice instructions. Yeah, the instructions are also really nice. Yeah, like I said, the only issue was the, the POP has been cut out. but And it was cut out very carefully. This guy was, was like... Very this guy was a meticulous. very anal kid. Very meticulous. meticulous. That's are we word. selling this? I don't think we should sell that. I mean, it's just... It's basically just like... What do you want to do with it then? I don't know. Give it to somebody? Do you want to like roll a die and see who gets it? Is there anything else to sell? Yeah, you got a couple uh, things over there. What do I have? The desk, the uh... Oh, the desk again? Yeah. We have the desk. What about these candy toppers? Anybody want them? Oh, yeah. I forgot about those. I said 15 bucks for the pair. Are they vintage candy toppers? They are. are they they Empire Strikes Back? No, no candy, though, right? There's no candy in them. And they're Hachi. Send their Hachi over. Of course, you can't freaking see it's them. Their Hachi's a real small there guy. They're just candy toppers. Yeah, antidote. 15 bucks for the pair. Yoda has some little candy spill spillage on him. Um, Chappy Chapman can't see it. Well, look again, Chappy. Here you go. You're good to go. I would like the X Wing box, maybe, said Chappy. All right, Chappy. Oh, um, someone's. I will give you $10 for the X Wing box. I'm not shipping it for $10, Brian. If you had already made a purchase, I would make, think that's okay. Yeah, it's not It's not worth shipping at 10 bucks. Yeah, it's not worth shipping. Um, I mean, we could offer it for 10 bucks to anyone who's already made a purchase. That's fine. I guess if you want to you do that, just to get it yeah, out. Yeah, we here. can get it in somebody else's box. All right, yeah. If you've if you've already made a purchase and you're interested in this incredibly beat X-wing box, you can have this it for ten dollars. This is just there bucks. to keep it stiff. Yep. Um, it's missing a side. I. I it's not great, but I, listen, it's it's. It displays it's already if you want to put something in it. It is if vintage cardboard. If right. you've already made a purchase, this it's side's ten bucks. Fine. And then the back is fine too. You know. I don't want to ship it for 10 bucks, but if you already made a purchase, I'm happy to do a throw it in the box. Cody is claiming the X-Wing box for 10 bucks. Sure, Cody. Cheers. Thank you. 10 bucks. Cody, I think, is our MVP of the day. I just hate throwing away cardboard. Yeah, I I don't want to display it in the store because it looks terrible. I wouldn't want to waste... Are we snobs? I guess we're snobs. I don't know. Are we snobs? No, we're not snobs. What did you say? 50 for the candy top or some, uh, 15, 15, right? Yeah, 15. Um, oh, Brian, so are we. We got it, man. The deal was for the diamond. Every time I spin this thing, I think of that. The Nurhachi's a real small guy. Yeah. The antidote you just drank, Dr. Jones. Um, Jeffrey got our reference. Yeah, see? I, I like that. All right. Um, There's a couple more things. I still have two weird things that I'm going to try to sell. I don't know how well it's going to go, um, especially with me lifting this up over my head. I don't know if that's a good idea. Um, I'll hold it. This? Here. Um, you're cutting the top off. You might want to... It's kind of tilted toward me. There you go. Like, like a guitar. You can actually hold it like a guitar. <laughs> so this is a coat rack and also a height chart. Flip it over. It's got inches on the back. It goes all the way up to 48 inches for a short little Oh, kid. Billy, you're taller than Wicket. Um, you yeah, know. Um, uh, we are going to break this down to ship it. I am not going to ship it in, in this giant. It does come apart with the screws. I will include all the screws. It is missing two pegs in the front. You're not showing me the back, so I'm show me the front. I'm just showing a couple little. It's got a couple little yeah, dings and stuff. It's been loved. It's not. It's not terrible. Well, the it's Vader me. picture is fantastic. The front is really nice. Look at that. Listen, if it doesn't sell this week, I'm just not selling this. Yeah, it's pretty rare. Because this is the second time that but it's I've not it complete, up. right? It's missing. It's not complete. It's pegs missing two pegs here. in the front, and it's missing the actual base that allows it to stand up. Oh. So it it as it is, it so cannot be stood up. In your Star Wars collector room, you just gotta lean this against a wall. We had it behind a case here in the store. Or you can like, you could build a thing to put it. You can absolutely, you could one two by four would do it, or like a, a flat piece of something or other. James had one of these when he was a kid. Now he forgot um, about it. Now he just remembers. Two hundred bucks. Listen, I know it's not in great. It's not in perfect shape. It's not mint. Um, ben wants to see it on camera too. Let's see how much we can see on camera too. Not this. a lot. <laughs> So the front the art is, is really nice. gorgeous, and that's the most important part, right? <laughs> Hello. Um, two hundred bucks. I am gonna disassemble it to ship it to you. Um, you wanna like hand it to me so like they can see it like going. Like the art is really nice. It looks really good. There's a little chip right here. There's a like. couple little things with it here and there. Like you can see. Yeah. Right underneath Vader's neck, you can see there's a little bit of a thing. It displays really great. It's weird. Go find one. That's the real. thing. They're um, very tough to find. 200 bucks if you want it. That's including free shipping in the United States. If you don't want it, that's cool too. I will just keep it. 
I figure Are you still 48 inches? I figure if nobody wants it after twice, then it's just not meant to be sold. So I'll just hold on to it. Hey, it's yours. It is what it is. It's from my like personal it. collection. Yeah, it is. I gotta pick up the desk and I'm afraid I'm gonna fall over on camera. I'll come around and pick up the desk. <laughs> Guys, bear with me. I'm having a lot of problems with my ears right now. I, I, I cannot move without getting dizzy. So my husband is gonna show you his cute butt and walk around. Whoa! We're, we're rated G. I said it's a cute butt. I could have said way worse. It is not. It's not a cute butt. No. It's absolutely a cute butt. Don't listen. To it. All right, we had this on last week. I love this thing. It uh, will we'll actually fit on here. Right. Just will just fit on there. Can I sit on it? Um, I wouldn't recommend it. We are trying to sell it as a absolute unit and not as toothpicks no offense i mean i can't even sit on it um this thing's beautiful this thing is awesome this thing's from my personal collection and the only reason i'm selling it or trying to sell it is because i bought some original art recently and i really need to pay for it um i still have one payment left so as you can see on the sides I don't know the art too. is fantastic it's really great it's it's in pretty con pretty great condition considering the age there are no major issues there are no major issues with nothing it. broken structurally it's very sound, sound yep it's very nice there's no scribbling there's always scribbling on the inside there is no can you other way you move your tablet it's fine Right there is all I need to see um, there's no there's scribbling no, on the inside no crayons the none screws of that are stuff. not rusty the screws are all still shiny and good yeah, uh, Sam, no, su Sam suggested you not sit on it with your cute butt. I won't. There's no <laughs> issues on the chalkboard it's itself. It's really nice. Because it's so it's nice that every time I look at it too hard, I'm like, I don't want to sell right it. There. There's art on the back right there. It's really nice. It's really nice. The uh, art is it's, really nice. It's rare, man. It's it's not a, a piece that you see often, especially in this condition. It's really nice. So this is actually going to hurt me. Like, I don't... I, I don't, I'm not going to auction it. I was thinking about auctioning it. I'm not. If nobody wants it, then it's just not. What? James is trying to find a picture. He's positive he, positive he has one. That's cool. I love this thing. It came from a friend of ours who passed away, so I am feeling feelings about selling it. Um, it's got two, two shelves. It does have some, some chipping around the edges, like here. There's a tiny bit underneath the seat. It has been sat on a few times. The seat does have a little bit of brown wear on the side. I have never seen one of these in nicer condition. I have seen these. There's one up right now for $1,000. It's not as nice as this one. I saw one in, like, pieces. But you can ask so whatever you want. You can ask whatever you want. Um, I saw one, like, it practically splinters sell for almost three. Um, I want six for this, and I will disassemble it to ship it to you. I will ship it overseas. I will ship it to Guam. I'll ship it to Alaska. Free shipping in the United States, 600 big ones. I think the only issue that I think is in, it could be called an issue is you go to camera two. Yeah. That's camera three. It is. It's just a little dark here. Some of that might have been, I don't I, know. I think, I think if yeah. you had a magic eraser, you could really clean it up. I wouldn't try and I, do it. I, you, if I you buy this, that if you buy this, go ahead and do that. I am not going to do that. The, the, the <laughs> art is amazing on it. I love it. I love this Wicked Return of the Jedi Wicked crossover cute art. I don't know who did this original art. I would love to know who did the original art. I absolutely love that. This is the kind of thing you put Certainly. in your collection room and people are like, Oh my God, I didn't know that existed. Or, oh my God, I had that. You're making me not want to sell it. Listen, if it doesn't sell for $600 right now on this stream, it's well, not, it's done. It's that not. Was, that was me trying to be like, uh, you know. The hype man? Yeah. The QVC? QVC. QVC. Yeah. Well, what about as a set? Look at this set here. Yeah, it's a set. It's awesome. It's a set, but like, you're not getting a deal. <laughs> Is it the last thing today? Um. I think so. Yeah. We even sold the X-Wing box, which is awesome. Uh, Cody, congratulations on that bad boy. Yeah, some people got some good deals. Today. Yeah, listen, we made, we have a payment to make at the end of this month for the rest of the Star Wars collection. Yep. I think we're almost there. We keep borrowing from ourselves to buy other things. Yep. <laughs> um, so at 8 tonight, we have Peg That's Warmers. 15 minutes. Yeah, we got Peg Warmers over on YouTube in 15 minutes. Go to Peg Warmers on YouTube, um, and then you'll see that there's a... Uh, a stream about to happen. You could join it live in the chat and, yeah. and say, "Hey, I came from the Imperial Commissary." We're wow. going to be in that chat talking and BSing and having fun. Uh, what's the topic for tonight? The topic for tonight is vintage board games. Which I think is, we talk about Star Wars, which is very near and dear to my heart. Um, every Sunday on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitch, we do our own Barter Town uh, claim sale. <laughs> this week, it's going to be oh, that's not what I want. Um, 
G.I. Joe and Star Wars parts or just G.I. Joe parts? Are we doing the Chop Shop this week? Yeah. Star Wars parts right. too then. Because that cool. works for the IC. Uh, vintage. I'm gonna, I have a tub of vehicles that are incomplete. I'm going to take parts off of them. That's and cool. we're going to sell parts. Oh, Sam would have given us $11 for the X-Wing box. Oh, Sam. Darn. Damn. Oh, Sam. Oh, Sam. <laughs> Sam. Potatoes. Boil them. Mash them. Stick them in a stew. All right. We are so amusing. It makes also, me sick. Wife says that Cody we says don't we don't need it. it. That's why I'm encouraging you to keep it. <laughs> Cody Nobody needs it. Cody, you you have until end of day today. If you want this thing, even if the stream is over, contact us. Nobody needs $600. it. Six hundred dollars. Nobody needs it. I don't need it, which is why it's here. But I like it. And go find one for real. Eleven thirty-five. Thank you, Sam. Um, we are done. Oh, Sam. So any of you who are new um, this week to us doing this. Please do me a favor, either shoot myself, Penelope. Justin is also in the group. You can shoot him a message. If you don't want to talk to a woman, that's fine. I get it. Uh, <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, you can go to our Facebook page, which I have up there, the link. That is the Farpoint Toys Facebook. We we are I mean, we are approaching 10,000 likes, and I'm very excited about that because that's influencer status. Oh, boy. Yeah, I'm excited about that. We can that. be like I somebody. Want, I can't name an influencer. Logan want, Paul. I want a sub for dinner. I want an Italian sub. Let's order dinner. Yeah. I'm on a diet, but you know what? If we're, we're ordering dinner, I'm not on a diet tonight. Yeah. Well, you can get a salad. Yeah, I can. Or we could just go get it. We could do that, too. Yeah. Well, we'll have right, a folks. thing in 15 minutes, so I don't know if we can. Yeah, we might have time. Yeah. All right. Guys, hey, guys, you. this is fun. We like this group a lot. I uh, love the IC. I would not be doing this anywhere else. This is fantastic. Nope. If you like us, check out our own thing we do on Sundays at 5 on Twitch, YouTube, and Facebook. I don't want to spam too much. 5 Eastern. 5 Eastern, standard, daylight, whatever time, 5 p.m. on Sundays. Um, this group is fantastic. We love you guys. Please message us so we can send you an invoice later tonight after our peg rumors thing. Um, Thanks for VIPs. We appreciate you guys. Yes. You guys got some good claims beforehand. A ton, a ton of UIC folks yep. came over and All became right. VIPs. This is turned into a podcast again. It is. Um, thank you guys for that. We appreciate all of you. I'm going to put that link up now. If you want to become a VIP, you guys could have seen this early, earlier today and bought it before it even came up here. Yep. Some of them did. There was there was a mail-away Boba Fett. Went like that in our group. It did. It's going to the Isle of Man. How cool is that? Is. All right, guys. Thank you for joining. If you want to hang out in Peg Warmers, cool. If not, we'll see you on Sunday or maybe again sometime in the IC. Yep. All There's right. always more Star Wars. Yep. Bye, see guys. See you guys.